hello everybody, welcome to uh, the CCL Season 49 quarterfinal between Luminous and his High Elves and Andy Devo and his Necromantic. In the booth with me is Kalon and Fymir. Hello! Hello! Hello everybody, here we are for one of the quarterfinals, one of the players here will go to the semi-final and we want to dedicate this stream, time to choose a random country, <laughs> to our viewers in Malaysia. We say mm -hmm. capital, is, capital is Kuala Lumpur, uh, his national list is called Nasi Lemak, which i 100% sure I didn't pronounce right or have any idea what it is. <laughs> so anyway, if you are from Malaysia, this uh, stream is for you. Yay! Excellent. This is a really lovely idea. It is brilliant. And, yeah. yeah, great idea. Well done. So, yeah, hello to all of our Malaysians. Getting the hate of every country one at a time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, thank you, Iravel. Uh, it was 210 was the difference, Jim. Uh, he fired an elf to make it down to 210. Yeah, so, so Andy was putting 40 caves on money to get a bribe. Mm. And, of course, the wizard. Yes. And uh, they're both pretty good teams. Like, Andy's is kind of min max, right? 1770 TV, very TV efficient. Yeah. yeah. Um, this wolf doesn't need. I mean, neither wolf has Dodd, which is pretty horrendous. But you know, got like guard and lots of guard and block and tackle and stuff. So like, it's it's very uh, like very workman like team, isn't it? And then similarly, yes. Luminous's team, you know, is 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 similar. <laughs> Thirteen players, nothing spectacular, but lots and lots of skilled stacks. So loads yeah. of blood step, and you know. If he can, if he like, he hasn't got anyone removed yet. If he can uh, weather the initial storm, which he has done, we may see a lot of basing and reliance on that blood step to generate a lot of pressure. Should be very interesting. Yeah, hundred percent. I mean, it's a nice um, necromantic team, as you've obviously you've alluded to. There's a good bit of guard on it, which is great, including on the ball carrier. But only two tackle uh, frenzy is not a good skill when you're coming up against this many uh, side steppers, mm. and. Um, yeah, I, I, I mean, it's a really difficult one to call. I think it's going to be a really, really exciting game. Wizard obviously has a huge impact, but we'll wait and see when it deploys and how it goes on. If he has to burn it in his own half on his own drive, uh, I think Lumi's going to be pretty happy with that. And having survived the three hits here is pretty big. Yes, and also Luminous has a very fast team. Yeah. I mean, these guys have a lot of movement. Not in the same player, mm -hmm. but the, the Blitzer has been a movement eight. Yeah, is uh, very nice. I'm not sure if I will, if it was me, I will pick movement for a blitzer because already you are gonna have, you know, a, a lot of uh, pieces with uh, movement with move eight. eight. Yeah, because you've uh, got the four catchers. Especially the well, last, yeah. the last movement. You know, the mighty <clears throat> blow uh, piece. Yeah, it, it's an interesting one though because there's not a huge amount else that they get on normals, right? I mean, you don't, you're not going to give them catch. You're not going. They've already got sidestep. Yeah. Uh, the frenzy is kind of fun, especially on a movement guy because you don't, you know, frenzy. Um, you don't have to GFI as much. Um, and having four, having six move eight is obviously better than having four move eight. Uh, although one of the catchers is uh, minus one, so one of the catchers is only movement seven. Hmm. Good turn from Andy here. Anyway, unlike yes. Unlike Vade in, in Luminous's last round, <laughs> who yeah. left like you know gaping holes and was very narrow, and he's wide hasn't left any holes, and he yeah. was able to even pile on and still make it like pretty compact and. Uh, mm -hmm. So uh, yeah. his uh, top pieces are protected. Yep. You're going to be tricking even the uh, ordering of getting the guard in if he did decide to go in, and then you're leaving your guard based on the wolf if he decided to go through that uh, that avenue. Which is the only kind of yeah you, you can't go you either way because you you can't hit no. him because you you can't get two guard in. No, I guess you could dodge out. No, he's only got one guard anyway, so you can't get yeah. two guard in to boots the wolf. If he blitzes this one, there's tackle there, so he can't go through. He might mm -hmm. he might well just blitz the fleshy and then wait another turn. Yeah, not terrible. Yeah, I, I hate the move up on, on the wolf. I think it's terrible. Um, is my assessment. <laughs> It just it should have been dodged, right? And yes. even the sidestep should probably have been dodged. But then because it's Devo and because of his propensity for surfing, the sidestep makes more sense for him. But then definitely it should have been dodged. Yeah. Yeah, I just think it's crazy to have not taken dodge. Just yeah. crazy. But you know, he survived but, you know, till seventy six, so you know it's it's worked out. We weren't I'm not I'm not liking this. What 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 is happening? Mm-hmm. 
Why, why is that the... <laughs> He's gone all men's again. It's what he does, isn't it? It's it's just what he does. He goes all men's. Yeah. And he's got all blood step. And if it, you know, if he can survive for a turn or two, it's horrific for his opponent. Yes. But I think but all the pieces to put in front of the wall with tackle. <laughs> yeah, put your it best be character. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure that's what that's. About, you know, there is you. there is a. Blotch step, uh, a blotch, a line over there that I can see. Yep, yep. It's Maybe not what I would have done. No. No. Pretty crazy. Did he forget that that was not the guard? Yes, he's he maybe putting him instead of the guard by accident, yeah. Yep. Yeah. To hit who? Well, if, if it had been the guard, he could have blitzed through the. He could have blitzed through the zombie, couldn't he? If that had been guard. Yeah. But it's still a bit shit because he'd have to dodge on threes with through tackle. Yeah. He's going for the one D. What? The... <laughs> okay, that's bold. It is, yeah. yeah. It's how he plays. It's how he plays. He goes balls to the wall. And it's, uh, you know, if he survives this turn, it's going to be yeah. horrendous for Andy, isn't it? It, it really is, yeah. Because uh, all of his uh, responsive pieces are pretty much tied up. Uh, the guard is out of range, so he can't even hit off with the goal. Uh, he doesn't have dodge on his wolves, so he can't dodge out. <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah, so he's going to probably have to 3 plus off this, and it's on tackle. Hmm. But uh, no, he has to do the JFI with the guard ghoul or the the, the the guard zombie to come back. Yes, because oh, it's not a G it's not even a JFI. What am I talking about? Sorry. One, two, three, four. He can't get the well. He can get this off, but he can't with any frenzy traps. So, like it's it's a lot of trouble. Yeah. Balls the wall is like taking the cheese grater to your balls. I mean, it is a bit, but it it works out for him most of the time, and you know, it probably does. It probably does work out for you most of the time, right? Like it's not. Was a very traditional uh, high elf strategy back in the day. You know, you have a lot of uh, bludgers, so you just base, 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 and that's it. Mm. Seventy percent of the time, you are safe uh, versus uh, players without tackle. Yep. However, oh, there's an instant full power. <laughs> there you go, you know, instant full power. And a stun. Okay. Interesting follow as well. Yeah, well, yeah but now it's a. Oh, he needed a... to guard onto the thing, yeah. yeah, yeah he actually he's didn't, though, did he? He actually didn't because he's already got guard from there, but it's a frenzy trap for the wolf, so he's got guard for the. if he wants to hit with the white, which yeah. he might do, but he wouldn't need it for the wolf, but then if he hits with a white, no. then he's not getting the white back. So it's, yeah. it's he can, really, uh, really... He can uh, hit with a wolf. The piece in front of uh, him is the uh, two die into one die. Yep. And that's frees the tackle uh, white. Yeah, he probably will do two in a one. You could also... Two in a one is a frenzy trap, but not the worst frenzy trap I've seen. Yeah. The other option is having a three plus. Oh, that doesn't work though, unless you've got a palm on the second one, right? Because he'll sidestep to here. Oh no, he. Oh, so he, oh yeah, so he'll sidestep to there and then to there. Mm -hmm. I just power him anyway. Well, he's good. He's got tackle on that guy at least, so it was only a five plus. But he could have also like let in two into a two because he could have sidestepped around to keep the uh, to keep this. Now he's got this two D to free up the wolf. Yeah. Yeah, and get a get a nice chain on him as well. Yeah, that was that was a good, that was the sensible way of getting the wolf. Uh, yes, yes, that was a good play. Since it worked, it, well, I suppose you didn't actually need the full powers on them. He just needed pushes to get it away, right? Is is the, is that the, the that yeah, wolf? Well, enough. having friends is more or less like having tackle, so. More or less, yeah, but less. <laughs> yes. Yes. It's more or less, but it's definitely less. And even after he, this happens. You know, he's still got to dodge this one out, and it's still it's still going to be a struggle to protect. Yeah. So it's two into two. Yeah. Want to keep... Um, doesn't get him. No, he doesn't, doesn't get him. Get him. Better choose, I think, block is the choice there. To keep, you know, next to the guard, the zombie, so just the, in case. Mm, yeah, oh, yeah. probably. 
Because if not, he was going to sidestep uh, one square down. Yeah. God, look how much better it would have been if this had been the Garda, though. Because, it, like, yeah. you know, it's, he hasn't got the Garda here now. Like, if this was the guard, then he's straight in for 2D on the ball. Maybe Luminous plays, you know, like it's a StarCraft, just uh, making a broad selection Ooh. of players and clicking the squares. <laughs> and they just set themselves. Maybe. Yep. I mean, it hasn't been as difficult as, as, as Luminous would have hoped. Like, this guy got powered instantly. But. Yeah. Yeah, this one obviously isn't getting powered because he's not even getting hit. Well, he might get hit, actually. Then he bows. This but one. The, not, in the, not in the piece. The, the who would prefer? Yeah, I mean he can't hit here because it's a two, it it's a two yeah. in two, two into one. Yeah. Oh, an uphill at that. Yeah. The ball's still on. He gets, so the 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 gets the yep. ball. If this break is not here an and break. Yep. Yeah, he's in a lot of trouble if this isn't any more. It isn't, and he followed. Wow. Interesting. Yeah. Makes the dodge. <laughs> well. And the foul, because he's oh, got the bribe. Good Lord, because he's got the bribe. It kills oh, him! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Dead! Wow. Works. Dead. works, but oh, God. works, but fuck me. God. What a high roll, Jesus Christ. Plus yep. one assist. Yep. And That's... he's now it's now it's safe as houses. Well. Wow. his guard is booked. He can one D him, there. can't he? He can one D him easily, but... He can. What a... Imagine Why? if it's been guard, though, then it'd be very dangerous. Okay, we have seen a play that uh, certainly I wasn't expecting. No, I mean, that was a very lucky turn from Andy, no wasn't it? He powered, was crazy. He powered two blodgers, uh, and that was the last chance for that one. That last hit was crazy. And that's obviously I mean, why dodge with the wolf yeah. into a foul. So many things could have gone wrong there. Yep. I mean, he has arrived. Okay, so it's a... Uh, Usually, it's, uh, how many chances of rolling doubles? It's, uh, About one in three. One mm -hmm. in three, so yeah. And then a one in six. So and then a, one in six. So it was about a one in eight, but he was less than one in three because there's so few assists. He was probably about a one in five to get sent off. So about one in 15, probably, to get sent off there. Fucking rowdy. Maybe it's a one in 12. Yes, yeah, I mean, yes, it was about. Yes. It was. Uh, why, why did I do that? I'm six rewarded with six a times, dead one in player. 30. Why did I say one in twelve as well? I don't know. Uh, one in five. So yeah, probably about one in thirty chance to get sent off at one in twenty-four. Something like that. Calcium will certainly approve of that foul, you know. Yeah. yeah. Yep. So he's done the GFI. So he's going to come in for this one day here with Rackle. Yeah. And the movement is did not get is not in range, and also he hasn't fouled him. Hmm. Will be this be a roll here? He might have to because he's just losing this half if he doesn't pow here. Oh, well, there you go. That's it. Easiest game of uh, Andy's life, pretty much. What a what a foul! Hmm. You can you can drop this guy on the back, and you can get this dodger out, and you can get this guy around. So still, it's not over. It's not over, no, no. but it's. Uh, but it's fucking terrible for Luminous. Like yeah. he rolled the dice, he rolled the dice and won last last match against Vid, and this time he's rolled the dice. Uh, well, in fact, Andy's rolled the dice a bit Andy's with that foul. The dice. Yeah. Dodge is a good skill. Keeps the wrestler occupied, so that he can take the other dodges out. Yeah. And the DP. In the DP, yeah, not the. <laughs> He's willing to fucking foul with his uh, best wolf. <laughs> yeah. He's got to get the. He's got to get this just up and out active, right? One, two, mm -hmm. three, four, five. I think you just <coughs> dodge once and get it out to like there where it should have been. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Imagine if he put the guard. Like I don't know if that was just a misclick or what, because if that had been the guard there, the guard's mm -hmm. in. He's got two D and he's powered it probably, hasn't he? Well, it's a. Uh... Maybe this is why he kept the reroll as well, because this is a two plus soft tackle. Uh, uh, true. To get that dodge in. Um, and so another yeah, both one of as these well. are off tackle. So he's probably got tackle. a GFI first for the ball. Uh, well, not the ball, yes. the ball carrier type man. Ball carrier, yeah. Yeah, he needs to get him around the back. GFI has got to tag this guy. Yeah, yep. yep. he's just going to dodge instead. Nice. Reroll conservation. 
Yes. Make it a three with a reroll. And uh, will he be regretting having rolled that three there when he needed them up here? <laughs> <laughs> because that's how the dice work. Obviously, that's how dice yeah. work, yeah. Well, he Resolve doesn't even technique. move him. Oh, wow. Mm. I mm. hate that. Yeah. Boy, howdy, do I hate that. Yeah. I feel he like he needed him there time, so... to... Yeah, no, he didn't run out of time. He was close, but didn't. Yeah. Yeah, he could have been like here, which is insanely good. Yeah. It's so quite good. a bit. Or he could have been in here, just screening off the, the white. Screen off the whole thing, so yeah. So he could have screened off the white, or, and, or he could have... Uh, or he could have come all the way up here or there or anywhere really in the middle. There was all sorts mm -hmm. of options he had. I think I would have I think I would have made the dodge and put in a reroll to get him. Active. <laughs> yes, he could have but, but he hasn't been knocked over by the tackle. No, he hasn't. So he might be occupying three <clears throat> players' actions this turn. <laughs> yeah, there's a pretty chance. Great, actually, keeping them all active is really, really nice. It was that was the big hit. Was was he going to get down on the on the tackle hit? But yeah. uh, he's going to be able there. to free one zombie. Well, well maybe hitting, hitting, hitting with a zombie on the other side. Yes. Yeah. True. 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 That, that yeah. frees the zombie in the middle. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Fair claim. But okay, but you know, it's freezing a zombie, so it's like. Mm -hmm. Good, but it's a yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, even trouble. just to get him back so that he can, uh, you know, not get frenzy trapped by these uh, by the wolves. Because currently, yeah. I mean, he is on guard and guard, so it's tricky. But he's, there's still some squares he can go to. I mean, he needs to free the wolf with tackle to be able to hit the ball carrier. Yes, the elf ball carrier. The elf, but the sure hands lad, yeah. Or just risk a dodge one in eight. Mm -hmm. With a ghoul. Yeah, he wants he wants this he wants this zombie back here so he can two D into two D. Yeah. And then ho exactly. hopefully power him. And then he's got wrestle as well, right? So then yeah. and then he can blitz here two into one. But and he the two D uh, him and then he can get the ball up somewhere. Don't know where. Like it's it's you know, this is the thing, it's it's balls to the walls by Illuminous, but you know it's it is, it's yeah. so it's much pressure. Really, really tense, yeah. nope. Yeah, okay, maybe this was the right play. Hmm. Well, now we can get his guard directly in the middle, right? Yeah. Hmm. I'm not sure how good that was. No, because that's going to occupy at least one of the wolves. Yeah. But he can use the um, he can use the shit wolf to just two into two to make the top guy fuck off and then have the other guy in the bottom to come down. But um, yeah, oh, he can guy, just go out and top? back in. The guy at the top has a side step, so it will be twin to one. Uh, no, he doesn't. The, the the guy at the top is just oh yeah. The, the lineman doesn't, but these two both yeah, have, so you can't get them off, yeah, can yeah, you? Yeah. You can't get these off at all now. But you can fill in the. the oh, goes with that he guy. Tackles him. Gets him. He's just gonna dodge off. He's just oh wow, dice yeah, lord, <laughs> dice lord Dave all this far. Yeah, yeah that's pretty crazy. Second death that that guy's inflicted. Yep. Not bad, not bad. Just as well, that wasn't a foul with the double six. <laughs> as as Duderino will say, I can't believe oh, wow. it, Hellboy, I can't believe it. <laughs> wow, he's blitzing and the, had to roll a... Oh, no, kidney, he could dodge away this way, but gets the yeah. pow, gets the... Room. No, he had to roll a pow, because otherwise he sidesteps to, to here. He, he just had goes to there, roll otherwise. a pow and just gets a yeah. pow. <laughs> yeah. and, now he's and he needs to run away, away because... Oh, he, did he just run out of time? Oh, yeah. But he's yeah, he he's staying there. He, so he blitzed and didn't move afterwards. Well, now the guard is in. So now, um, we may well see two D on the ball. Except there's nobody left to hit him apart from this guy who oh. didn't dodge last turn. Yeah. <laughs> They're kind of coming at him from the wrong angle as well. <clears throat> is he any wrestle left on the pitch? Nope. No. Or the elves? No. Wow, how lucky is yes, Dave? Yes, there is, there is just, one. It's just insane. There is a wrestle strip ball. Uh, oh, yeah, but... Yeah, oh, cool. but he's, a, he's a little far away. Yeah. And moves. And move bust. And he's busted. He ran out of time, Lehman He just ran out of time. Crazy. Yes, he didn't took the hit because uh, the, he yes. ran out of time. 
Yeah. Gets the pal. Wow. Oh, baby. Look a dog. Loom Anything there. you can do, right? <laughs> but, <laughs> kill, kill it. Kill it. But is he blitzing? For, uh... I don't think he's blitzing. No, is he? he didn't blitz. No, there's no uh, no exclamation mark. Ooh. Kind of fortunate there. He didn't want to catch that. Does the wolf catch it? No, but that's a pretty fantastic scatter. But he still has the blitz to come, so there's, there's something good. You know, that was the blitz. The cool it, you know, the high elf is scoring just on that piece. Yeah, yes. yeah. I, yeah. I, I, I wondered if it was worth just blitzing, just in case you power, like, you know, blitz in the end zone, and then he'd have picked it up and passed it and scored, wouldn't he? Yeah, I think it was just it was a because he didn't know what was going to happen later, so he didn't blitz with him. Yeah, but like this can't almost can't be good. Yeah. That's the problem. No, because right? he, he he just can't score now, right? Yeah. And uh, I guess he can screen he up all of this. He can, and if he, but the that that, that wolf doesn't have dodge, but he does have sidestep. <laughs> this wolf doesn't have dodge, but he is killing a player every turn, <laughs> which is making yes. which is and making this defense a little bit tricky. Yes, yeah. sidestep makes it more usual when you chain him so he can move whatever he wants. So that's you know like the, the ultimate uh, Andy Dable frenzy uh, oh, chain uh, the play. No, I haven't moved him off. No. Um, why didn't? Why did he run out of time? Because it was a, it was a tough turn, right? It was a tough turn. It wasn't. <laughs> oh, and he oh, fails wow. to dodge with tackle. Wow. Dead? <laughs> no. Well. Okay. That was not the cleanest turn. No. And he still terrible. hasn't brought the other guys down. Yeah. But he it's can. Uh, he has problems if he wants to pick it up with a with a ghoul. He has been unlucky though, because like these three. Players yeah, have all insane. been down here, right? It's where, like yeah. where he's getting outnumbered and getting beaten up. He, he's doing fine. <laughs> and here, yeah. when he was outnumbering and shouldn't have been fine, he's just been getting yeah. absolutely fucked. This should have been like six versus four, <laughs> seven versus four. This this area should have been, but he's had three players removed. So he has been super super unlucky around the ball. Yeah. And now I think you know that Andy's removed so many players now that it's uh, it's probably going to be tidied up. Mm -hmm. Certainly, he's uh, it's 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 all uphill for him, um, for sure. Uh, maybe Leet Leet saying that he did give away way too many hits, but yeah. it was the it was the specific guys that were getting hit. And, like, you know the thing of uh, giving well. a lot of uh, blocks. That's true, but with so many side steppers, many of those blocks were really really risky. Yeah, yeah. and the the, 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 the know, blocks he was giving away were up here, and, and he's been fine up here. That's the thing. Like when he was outnumbered, he was fine. He just tagged people to get hit, and they were fine. The people that he tagged to get hit, yeah. whereas here he was outnumbering and. And just got absolutely fucked. <laughs> also, let's not forget that uh, Andy has a wizard, so the elves need to be super aggressive. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the tourney foul was absolutely crazy. Yeah. Andy was more that's, than a uh, That's it. Well, uh, Ali, are you asking which country we are honoring, which the big words? Of which country we're on are the ones from Malaysia? <laughs> yeah, Malaysia is today. Mm. Which uh, the national flower is the Ibiscus rosa sinensis, which I have no clue how it looks <laughs> or even is pronounced. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I don't, I don't like it either. Lee. I don't like it either. But there you go. It, it obviously it's worked for him mm -hmm. for about thirty games this season. Um, so, you know, he thought it would continue working. <laughs> and I mean, it nearly it's got did. Him, it's got him this far in Chalice. Mm. It nearly so did. It doesn't pick up with him. On, on nearly any other turn that, than, than that turn. Like, you know, this has gone so lucky for Andy. Like, it's so easy for this to have been 1-0 Luminous already. It's so easy for, for it to be 1-0 already. But not only is it not 1-0, he's also had his team slaughtered. <laughs> Well, only one official left. Yes, true. But that here comes the well. foul, and... Okay. Terrible foul. Should have used the one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, no tackle so to interfere nice. with this. And... Does do the GFI, and the pickup is good. But, I mean, he's still in um, trouble, isn't he? Because there's still an instant 2D yeah. on the ball. 
Yeah, so he just leaves these guys there so that they can... Um, I really didn't like the 4 plus pickup last turn. I think he had to... Like, if he'd screened off this yeah. first... Yeah, that would have been fine, yeah. And then the probably up, wouldn't have put the, the reroll in. Have been the last action of the turn. Yeah. I concur. Yeah, he should have definitely... He should have definitely intersected. Because now this guy's getting... You know, this guy got... These guys not got knocked over. They could have all been screening here. And then able yeah. to react, pick up the ball next turn. <laughs> Especially when, like, you know, you're watching the game and you're like, right, it's going to be one of those games where everything he touches just dies. <laughs> yeah. So the likelihood of me getting this four plus pickup, aren't, like, uh, I'll have to put a reroll into it and then fail the dodge. Oof. Yeah. Rerolling tackleless, blockless. Yeah, I, well, yeah, I don't like that. I, uh, I know that he is definitely behind, but. That was uh, a. That was a hope and a prayer. Not the best. I mean, now he is. Now it but, really is. But he's, uh, but he's uh, in a very, very dark place now. <laughs> he is, yeah. So it's just, uh, you know, damage mitigation at this stage. Um, see what else he can do. To, uh... I mean, it's damage mitigation by basing with literally everybody again. Yeah. <laughs> this, this is not damage mitigation. This is a, a damage provocation. <laughs> yeah, provocation. <laughs> and getting fouled by a dirty player. Like, it's still yeah. pretty horrific. Uh, yeah, there is a bribe, yeah, Lehman Russ. Yes. Uh, hello, Rick Baseman, by the way. Yep, hello. And I think I think this was a fine... Honestly, I think this was a fine strap by Lehman Like, he got so unlucky. Like, I don't know, probably he's four times out of five, he's 1-0 up right now. I like, agree, yeah. He got so unlucky with that. Like, it was... I mean... He didn't put he the guard put in the right Andy, place, though. He put Andy in a lot, a lot of problems. I mean, Andy even missed free hits mm -hmm. because yeah. he ran out of time so yeah. it's like you know like uh, oh is he stuff or something like that it was like oof that was really really hard the uh, times that were saved because he was very lucky with the block dice yeah yeah, yeah so I mean you know relying on the frenzy and the fact that he's got two tacklers but you know just just removed shit yeah like that's the thing if, if these four if these four players who were removed were up here it's yeah. a touchdown isn't it but yep. instead, they were all the critical players down here, <laughs> like that that blitz that was a that was a pow. But like you know, then he obviously ran out of time anyway. But it was a super hard turn. Like he's he's caused him a lot of headaches. But yeah, he gets the blitz and sidestep away. And cool. now he's got so many he's got so many players advantage now. It's it's easy yeah, for him, it's, isn't it? It should be. It's um. I mean, there's still tricky bits where it can go wrong, and this is a very fast team. So I mean, they can still harass the ball. Oh, he comes back inside. Yeah, well, I guess. The, I suppose he's, that's where his that's where his defense is. But I mean, he still needs the rest of these guys to get out of there. To I think he prefers the right side of the beach. Nah, it just didn't matter. He could have gone either way. He's just going over here. Yep. Use yep. both Fair the fleshies. Mm -hmm. He can make a Venga bus, in fact. Mm -hmm. But uh, I doubt it because he's going to use that zombie to fell. And that's uh, after he does the two into one down the bottom here, and then gets the dodge off with the wolf. Oh, wolf, sorry. Plenty of elves left. Oh, I don't know. I don't know about that. Like they've lost the rackler, they've lost the tackler. <laughs> so work. for this for the this strip, drive, they're pretty fucked. The strip baller yeah, is still they, there. They're, they're under a bit of duress for the drive, but I, <clears throat> I mean, the, we've got a whole half to go. Yeah, the game is over. The game isn't over at all. Yeah. Drive-wise, it's over. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah, the, the drive. He is can get. Is. He can get super lucky with uh, the wrestle elf. You know, trying to go for a red dice or something like that. Mm. That's, a, that's a good uh, point. Actually, turn five, ball stabilized, still in his own half. Maybe he could just get these guys all back in front, and maybe yeah. he can. You know, maybe he can make force a potato out. Maybe. Well. I was uh, about to say, like, if it was any other team, I think they'd be in a lot of trouble. But with the fact that it's Necro, I think they're they should be fast enough to be able to break a line when they need to. Mm, um, I don't know. Those wolves are a little uh, behind. Undercooked, yeah, and they're way they're way back. Yeah, yeah like he has to get three plus dodge off. Yeah, they don't have dodge, and, well, uh, and like one yeah, as well. yeah, everyone else is slow, right? The the, the fleshies mm. are slow. The, the zombies are slow. Um, this is a tricky one. Does he decide? So he's, he's going to dodge. Now, if he stays on the guard, he oh, just goes there and then back up. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't get him. 
No he, instant he pow. Go there, but no, he's not. He's not going to give away an extra mm. block. Wow. Mm. wow. I would have wow. definitely. Yeah, I would have definitely. Well, we saw him do it earlier with the with the um, uh, that, frenzy uh, lad. That zombie. But this is so much stronger now because now we can bring that guy over there, and this yeah. is uh, one into one. And that'll do it. Only a stun! <laughs> Diced! Oh. Oh. Diced, Dice. lads. Diced. Dice. So he can dodge him off, blitz him, dodge yep. him off, and he can have like a bit of a screen here. He can. And yeah, maybe he just tries to screen mm -hmm. and hopes that he can get in the way to stop the score. Because it be, it's been pretty good, to be fair, taking five turns for stabilization. Yeah. It is a very much Chunter style. Chunter style high elves, isn't it, basically? Hmm. Yeah, it's interesting just uh, the way the different elves have. Uh, you have to work out how to get their timing right for when you're in the game, you know? Um, well, you don't have to. You can just go balls the wall, turn one, can't you, and see if it works. Yeah. <laughs> I remember being shown. Um, uh, one of Adev's favorite teams from Fumble, which was a dark elf team that just had like just everything had blood step fend, um, and uh, yeah, it's just so it's just so powerful at doing like loads of really annoying things. Oh, I Still had the, the right skills everywhere else, but yeah, it's oh, pretty crazy not to have uh, not to have got more guys back around the top of the ball because um, the things about the, the like all of the hard work was to stop the ball getting down the pitch, and this is just trying to go for damage, which I don't like. Because yeah. yeah, sure. he he can just fuck off now. Like, I've got no idea what the kickoff event was Luminous. It wasn't a blitz. It's just that uh, Luminous is a madass, basically. Yeah. <laughs> basically, he just goes I'm, all uh, mans, and he's got loads I'm of. I'm pretty sure. Stuff, pretty sure Lumi got a uh, got a uh, reroll. Mm. Yeah, but no, that's just how he plays. Yeah. yeah, like you know what I mean. Like that's it's just too easy to get forward now. Mm -hmm. If you dodge this guy off and this guy and this guy, you could. Have, I would have even tried this for too. Like I know it's. Yeah, I would. Yeah, the last, last, last action, definitely. Um, yeah, because it's not just about being able to get him forward, but he, like he's got his flesh, he's mobile and able to go forward, which is you know. So now I don't think there's a way of him being able to stop the ball. Mm. Yeah, it's going to be really hard. I mean, he still could. He definitely could have done if he got people back. But he still could, just because of the fact that, you know, he, he can only go forward four, can't he, next turn. But that's just enough. It's, it's just enough, yeah. And that's uh, that's the real, the real issue. Yeah, he just had to. He had to occupy space in front there, Lumi. Mm -hmm. A bit of chalice nerves, maybe. Maybe. It's pretty cool if he brings this guy down and covers that guy in the side of him, and then he can blitz free with the nice wolf. Oh, he already used his blitz. I forgot that. Well, so that's not great. I mean, he's happy because it goes down, but <clears throat> he's stuck where he is. <laughs> not quite. But yeah, the problem is, for Lumi, okay, brilliant, like, that's the best possible result, but guess what, you've still got four players yep. <laughs> stuck on, on stuck three, on yeah. and, you've got, and you've got less players than him. This is just a yeah. terrible, terrible trade. Terrible it is. Trade. It is. It's not, it's not really very elfy at all. It's just not, not good mm -hmm. <laughs> at all. <laughs> I guess you can base, base those guys, ba dodge off base, dodge off base, run, dodge off base, just dodge everyone off and base everything. Yeah. Five players, uh, one, two, three, four, five, so he just bases everything and then this runs back. Maybe he blitzes one of them. He's got three players having to dodge off tackle. <laughs> Terrible. This is not a good day to be a high elf. No. 
But still, there is a, the one turner attempt. I think Andy Oli has two stand firms. And a sidestep. And, and a sidestep, mm. so yeah. So he's going to risk the sidestep. Yeah, it's be interesting. I mean, I think he probably has to, right, against a moving yes. on sidestep. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is good. Now he can put a tight step on the ball if he wants. Yep, this guy probably comes up to here. He mm. goes there. But now he hasn't got anything to tag this first year, which he wanted to. Yeah. As an elf expert, I agree. <laughs> oh, God. Brilliant. Brilliant PC. Great to have uh, such a, an esteemed elf uh, coach in, in chat. Yeah. The funny thing about PC's elves is they're remarkably slow and unagile for elves. <laughs> he said he's an elf expert, not an expert at playing elves. <laughs> I guess he has played a, a versus a lot of elves, yeah. He's, he's, <laughs> yes. played a, he's played a few more games on elves than I have, I tell you that much. Mm. And then, then most of chat, to be fair. Yes, that's true, yeah. That is very true. Do you know what? It's funny, we were talking about how Purple Chest's an elf coach and uh, Peravale's a chaos coach, but funny enough, when I did versus <laughs> Peravale and PC, it turned out to be Proils versus Dwarves. I was shocked. <laughs> Wait, are you but saying, like, what? Pro presumably Peravale was on the Dwarves, right? Yeah, of course, yeah. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Perennial pro elf player Peravale. Yeah, that's very really good. Yeah. That's a bit of alliteration there. Yeah, yes. you're welcome, Leash. Everyone loves that, don't they? Alliteration? Mm. Yeah, it's it's fun. Yeah. I mean, this no. is still just a one in nine dodge if it has to be. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> like, as, you can go as brainless as you want in this and still just roll like eight times out of nine, you get away and you're fine. No, he can. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, not oh. eight out of nine now. <laughs> no. Well, that is exciting. Down he goes. He had the. Uh... He had something fun planned here, I don't doubt. Uh, may have to curtail it. Yes, uh, it's it's this blitz in here and then freeing him, right? The question is if he can feel the square. This is what it is. You blitz him, push him, and then you hit him again, then chain him out. I <laughs> uh, haven't thought of it yet, Store. Maybe like Jim Cast. <laughs> Fantastic Cast. <laughs> no, that's mm -hmm. terrible. It is terrible. Yeah. Fantastic casts. <laughs> <laughs> I might just yeah, I might just do it like this, because then you can hit him there, and then he can only go here, and then you can hit him again out. So you yeah, you could just you could just hit there. Either either one of these are fine, either chaining him out or or hitting him. But twice. it's the guard there that he's that he's next to is the issue, isn't it? Mm, no, because he stands him up, and he's got, oh right, okay, so he's got yeah, two and a two. Boom, boom. Okay, cool. And he obviously can't stay in contact because the wolf will be yep. there. Yep. Uh, nope. Okay, well now I'm bamboozled. Mm hmm. Yes. The important thing is that it took him two and a half minutes to make this decision. Yeah. <laughs> right. Okay, now he, he can uh, oh, no, he blitz, blitz with a uh, tackle yeah. on the floor. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's and really then, unexciting, though, isn't it, compared to. Twas. Yeah, but he'll kill him, so it'll be fine. Yeah, probably. Yeah. And okay, this does leave blow. you with tackle on three players, right? Which is very nice. Tis. What? Oh, I tell you what happened was he'd already used his reroll. That should have been a double skulls into a double pow, and then that would have killed him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And he can only go four squares forward, so. Mm. If if there's some dice rolls from Luminous here. Oh, no, okay. Yeah, yeah, so it only has to go four forward. Duh, of course he can go there. But, you know, <laughs> if, if Lumi rolls some dice here, he might be able to get him. For sure. And that's a. Uh, nothing die. happened at all. I thought there was going to be another dead wolf. Oh, look, you've got three useless players now. Well done. 
Like mm-hmm. this was so bad. This was just literally so bad. This mess over here. That was a big mistake from Naomi. Like the, the going balls to the wall is just a choice, you know, and it's how some people play, and it, it's going to work a lot of the time. Fair enough. But this was just definitely wrong having these three guys up here when he he had to switch to getting in the way because it taken five turns to stabilize. Hello, Beard G89. Uh, there is going to be a podcast, a weekly podcast on Saturdays, probably, um, mm-hmm. where we'll just talk shit. So completely different to other Saturdays. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> just without having to watch uh, Blood Bowl. Yeah. yeah, exactly, yeah. Cut the pretense and of watching Blood Bowl. <laughs> you're wondering at what yeah. time it will be. It will be at 5 in the morning in some part of the world. Correct. <laughs> yep. Yeah, it will. Yeah, it'll be uh, it. So we're we're gonna record it on uh, on 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 Tuesday at twelve. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and and then it'll be available to you at five a.m. in the morning, wherever it is that you live. Yeah, because why wouldn't it? Twelve p.m. Right, that's that's right. Yeah, obviously. Yeah. Or twelve a.m. Which one? No, twelve a.m. It's you just say twelve on a Tuesday at twelve. Okay. Because if you say which is whether it's AM or PM, then it has. Because you can't say, well, there's no such thing as twelve uh, PM, is there? Because exactly, yeah. So yeah, twelve exactly. PM. <laughs> yeah, so twelve PM works. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, the free the free form nonsense is really what's been getting us down. Like, I mean, it'd be fine if it was um, if it was a vodcast, because then I could explain through interpretive dance, which uh, as uh, as you those of us who've been with us for a while myself and flicky discussed this before that is my preferred medium of uh well you studied the theater when you were uh, down in those uh, yeah fields of ireland that's right yeah <laughs> I, I studied when i was old in um colleges in ireland as well but uh it was nice to spend some time with the fairy folk um as a youth this has been diabolical. Like you know, yeah. from, from like the the first the first like three turns were like super unlucky for Luminous. He played high risk, high reward, and he got punished massively. Super unlucky, but then he's played a bit shit since then. <laughs> no uh, offense. Pretty much. No, no, but I mean, I, I think that's a fair enough uh, comment overall. Uh, I think he just kind of lost the plot with the debts. Maybe. Uh, yeah. It seemed to me that he may be a bit t- tilted from it. Yeah, maybe. Which is uh, a little surprising, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. And, um, yeah, I think the, I think he may just not write properly have his mind on it. Hopefully he's going to give himself an old shaky shake at uh, halftime and get himself back into it. Mm. Give but, his head um, a wobble. Yeah, exactly. Or whatever it is that the Americans' version of that is. Yeah. No, no J5. No. So one, two, three, four, five, six, Sorry. seven. Preempted. This guy can go there. Oh no. This guy had to tag the, the, Lord to tag the, the fleshy. This guy had to tag the fleshy, right? And then this guy goes over here somewhere. Yeah, because the fleshy just immediately goes. Well. Because if you, if if you tag the fleshy, mm-hmm. and then and then tag him, then it's not easy for him to get too deep to hit you at all. Yeah. So, yeah, do you blitz with the flesh golem? There yeah, wasn't from... PC. There wasn't PC. That was not on. Um, sorry to break it to you, but this guy is minus move. <laughs> so this was the yeah. player PC thought of was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, GFI, GFI, but no. This guy's move seven. <laughs> uh, that's really funny, Ali. <laughs> <laughs> It's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> the funny thing is because I'm a very fat man, so I started laughing, and then the top half of my body jiggled. So oh, as, if, there you go. as if art was imitating real life. <laughs> yeah, you had to go straight through, and then the five off tackle and the three off tackle. So yeah, that became horrendous. Yeah. Thing. It, 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 it turned into a really bad. Uh, so yeah, that minus move really fucking him. Because I'm sure if he was moving it, he would have gone for that, yeah. Uh, very professional work by Andy to uh, make sure that he's... Um, wow. Uh, oh, yeah, of course. Well, the that's side crazy. Yeah, 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 to, to yeah. the sidestep is the issue. 
by making sure that he's um, making the score back very hard. Yeah. So if it's a push, he's got a GFI, but he gets the power. You see when they, you know, you see when you roll pals. Yeah, when you power, when you power them every single time, it, you can deal with the uh, the chunter style defense. Should have been a bad, bad play for Ronaldo. That should have been a five SPP play. You know, he didn't optimize uh, That's right. SPP. <laughs> yep. Correct. <laughs> didn't even kill that lad. And now the question is, will he put a side stepper on the line? Yeah. And he's and got which one. <laughs> He's got a chance of a really easy semi as well after this versus Zons. <laughs> like, Zons will never win Chalice. And I think the Zons, we all think the Zons are favoured versus the Woodies. And, yes. you know, I think the Zons have got no chance versus this um, this Necro team. So, um, yeah, he's, this is almost a get in the final this match. Almost. Well, bear in mind as well, he is two points off his killer, who got knocked out earlier in the game, uh, is two points off getting tackle as well. Yeah, yeah. Jesus, uh, Sammy, just stop spending points. You are filling the screen there. I can read, read the chat. <laughs> oh, wait a second, wait a second. I can read the chat. Keep doing it, keep doing it. <laughs> this is great. That's what we needed. We needed a woman to come in and clean up Dagobah. <laughs> right, it's more like Moss Eisley, is it? Which one is it that you refer to your chat as? Necromunda. From, the Necromunda. Uh, the Necromunda yeah. from the... Yeah, it's fair. Yeah. It's on no, to the final, uh, says PC. And yes. um and Sergeant is uh, doubting Amy and Andy is able to get an easy semi. Yeah. Fair. Yeah. yeah thanks, Samage. That's <laughs> fucking legit spamming Samage. Fair play to you. <laughs> yeah. I like you too, Jim. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, she's starting a trend. Yes, Necromunda is a yeah. very famous uh, city, well, hype city in a Warhammer, Warhammer 40k, full of mutants, gangs, and all kind of stuff. And the um, uh, it's where the uh, Imperial Fists get their uh, get their um, recruits, right? Is it? is it from there? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. What do you think oh, yeah. about this from uh, from Luminous, by the way? Do you think he should be do he should be doing the Kfog, shouldn't he? Yes, he should. Yeah. He would need well, like. What do you mean with doing the K fog? Not failing uh, in so the role. I'm using. <clears throat> yeah, so he 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 needs to go up and here. hit that guy, and so that he can push him back in, so that he starts getting the uh, the chain, Ooh. so that he can push frenzy. that guy to pull everything else back into the thing. Yeah, he's got frenzy and move nine sidestep. So, unless he intends to do it on the right hand side, but that seems less optimal given. Besides, they're given the uh, flesh column. Yeah, and he hasn't got a reroll either because he used it last turn, so it's really a low odds, whatever happens. But um, he could have oh, yeah, yeah. done this three plus dodge and then pushed him to there and then pushed him to there. And mm -hmm. then that could have then pushed into the uh, sidestep. And he could have gone to there. Oh, no, no, I guess maybe he couldn't have done it actually. Maybe he's got a double dodge. Maybe he's got a double yeah. dodge. Yeah. I think, to be honest, it's that Devo was on to it, which is why he's got that guy so far wide. Yeah. Move nine doesn't have sprint. No, but I mean, you could push him twice, right? You, you'd, you'd use this to get the initial push, and then you'd push him again. It's not over, even if he doesn't get the one turner, which I don't see him getting. You know, yeah, he's not getting. He's not getting the one turner. <laughs> he's not getting the one turner. He might get a riot. But he's not getting the one turner. I think to get the one turner, you have to uh, you have to go the K fog method. Yep. I mean, he could do, still do some dodges with a quick snap as well. Might help because he'll get him everything over to the right, and he might be able to incorporate that guy on that side then. But it still involves a lot of dice. He's not going <laughs> to. He might Fair with enough. a riot. Fair enough. Yeah. He might with a riot, but he ain't scoring this one turn. Yep. PC asked you an important blood bowl question there. Is it over? Um, almost. Yeah. Almost. It's it's pretty over. Is it your bedtime PC? <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty over. It's not I over mean, though. It's not over, no. Like, um I think this is all kind of fine. I mean it's a bit of a shame to have gone in one nil considering the how uh, nice the start was. It's a shame to be done your Apple, but 
overall, I think this is all fine. Yeah, and Davos still got the wizard. It's just that it's it's bugged out. So he's still got the wizard. Still got the uh, still got the babe. Uh, it's not babe. Bribe. I don't know why I just said the wrong thing. Um, is is he going for a? Oh, get a surf and hurt a zombie. That's great value with two re in reserve. <laughs> so we we don't know whether that's uh, kicked in yet because uh, the bug. Yeah, so he's actually fine. So it did did it did nothing. What what bug? Uh, because re regen doesn't. You don't know until he's in because it had showed the red cross. But that guy's um, standing up. He's fine. Yeah yeah yeah. He's yeah yeah. yeah. But I mean, it's it's arguably a bug that it shows it the other way, isn't it? But yeah, this is a bug that he says yes. in, yeah. in the thing, yeah. yeah exactly. Same happens with Throw Rock and Regen. Throw Rock does the same thing. I like a Mr. Page, because he's Canadian, calls it Throw a Rock. Instead mm. of Throw a Rock, he calls it Throw a Rock. Mm. Yeah, it's kind of nice. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes, such a difference. <laughs> 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 That's super interesting, Kayla. Says, says the man who translates for a living. You can take my yes. word for it. It is actually pretty big Yes, yes. Uh, but I translate from English to Spanish, you know. Yeah. <laughs> but the pronunciation difference. It's like the yeah the the breakdown in that is really interesting. I think it's I think it's fun. I think accents like that are cool. Oh, correct. Yeah, correct. <laughs> I'm never blind to accents when it comes to English because for it's sure. not my mother language. It, well, uh, I would never have guessed. <laughs> uh, that's why I'm. That's why I'm saying it's a. Uh, it, it is. I thought it was. I thought it. I think it's good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> film. <laughs> film. Yeah. Yeah, film is great, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I went to see a good old film. Hmm. So you know the the apple's gone and Davos got a bribe and a whiz, but it's still not that bad. For Lumi. Mm -hmm. It's pretty uh, bad. But it's not that bad. He's still got 11 players. One, one tackler, but KO, but it's not the end of the wall. There's no pieces are still there. Yeah. But you know that I'm you know that I'm trying to you know, I'm just trying to sell it as a contest. <laughs> yeah, you're doing a really good job of it as well. I mean I, I, I still think it's it's totally open. It's only one nil. Um if you can get the wizard out, the wizards fizzle. There's a bunch of other stuff can happen. If he decides to plug it in early, could he just do hold it out and see if he can get in later? I don't know. But uh, I still think there's a big, big load of big guess. I think Andy's probably like 90% to win. That's fair. We'll see what happens. Mm. I'll say uh, don't, uh, don't, maximum, it's not the end of the YouTube or the end of the stream. Maximum 87.5%. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, yeah, I rounded so, yeah. it, of course. I think he's actually 86.37. Nice. Uh, okay, 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 okay. I mean... We don't pull deal here, lads. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. So the in in the Irish accent, we say film for like so for a movie or a film, we say film uh, or cling film. Mm. Yeah. There you go. We also say petrol for petrol mm. or gasoline. Yeah. Okay. Adding adding een as a suffix at the end of any word to make it uh, diminutive. So like uh, Jimine, or oh, that, Fimer, that's super, Fimer Ean. That's super interesting. Thank you. <laughs> super interesting. <laughs> super interesting. <laughs> yep. Brilliant. There you go, Antrim lad. Antrim lad knows. Antrim lad, to be sure. Yep. <laughs> Guess where he's from. I'm not going to judge where is anyone from after me run up with countries around the world in the today. <laughs> Middlesbrough? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure the guy called Antrim lad is from Antrim. Whoa, I don't know. There was someone called there was someone called Burra Burra Steve or something, and I said he's from, from Burra, and then they were like, he's not from Burra. And I was like, well, why are you called Burra why, why Steve if you call? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the true north. That's it. Yeah. Go on. How are you, by the way, Antrim lad? Great to see you, buddy. <laughs> you don't offend the Spanish. I don't know, the Spanish is not yeah, offended. Yeah. The Spanish is uh, the 40, nearly 50 million uh, Spanish people, I can say to you that only literally dozens know who Jimmy are. <laughs> 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 
Correct. <laughs> Literally dozens. <laughs> Without any work or hard work. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if, I, if, I want the, if I want this kind of child, I'll go to Andy Davis uh, child. He's a famous uh, Spanish uh, hater. In fact, before today, he said that enchiladas are Spanish food. <laughs> Ooh, P. Diddy. Yeah, it's the equity. The equityometer has gone to eighty-eight point four three two. Yeah, the slider, sliders are going fucking crazy all over the place here. <laughs> I definitely need. I, I need an equity meter that I can. <laughs> I can just make whatever I want. <laughs> yes, yes. I told you. I told you. You should not see like that and just keep it moving up and down. You know. Hmm. Yeah, it's random percentages. It needs to. It needs to be. It needs to be a a, a meter and and like a percentage. That would be the best. Yes, yes, yes. So we can have a, an utterly precise percentage like Dio. <laughs> That's the best yep. thing. <clears throat> so throwing both of the flashies over on the one wing. That'll never come back to. Well, I mean, yeah, three and eight. Three and eight would be pretty incredible, but yeah, that seems excessive. It's really excessive. Yeah. Yeah. Well, oh Phineas God. North, there, there is a joke to make about the fact that you are transitioning to Spanish olive oil, you know, but I'm not going to say it because this is an open uh, mind, the, the uh, safe space, yeah, safe we're, we're, space, yeah. environment yeah. Mm -hmm. for people. Find me as the Spanish like, Pluto. <laughs> Because the it's Spanish olive oil, so I said he's the Spanish Pluto. Oh, very good. <laughs> yeah. It's a, pop it's a Popeye joke. <laughs> yeah, what? So, uh, I'm lost here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to respond to it appropriately. <laughs> there you go, Jim. Thanks. Popeye, because Popeye's girlfriend is called olive oil. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and the bad guy, the bad guy who wants to, who, which is, oh, he's Popeye. really rapey as okay, well. Okay, yeah, Popeye. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, Popeye. Popeye. Okay. Yeah. yeah, accents don't Spanish matter at all, Femir. Popeye. Yeah. Popeye. Popeye, yes, literally how it's pronounced the name in Spanish. So we don't get the joke of the pop and the eye. Yes, yeah. Mm. You know, we don't get the, oh yeah, because, you know, Popeye, because one of his eyes, the pop, the, 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 they never got that in Spanish. <laughs> But mm. well, so the the French, because well, he's Belgian as well, isn't he? Uh, Tintin, but he's not called Tintin. He's called Tantan. Mm. Tantan. He's called Burr Tintin. Is is in the best in the best uh, version of him? Yeah, is that the guy who isn't from Burr? No, no, he is from Burr. <laughs> All right. <laughs> he was a blood Burr bowl coach. Tintin. His name was like Burr Dave or something. Right. And I said he's probably from Burr, and then people were like, no, he's not from Burr. <laughs> The bird, bird Tintin is quite funny. For anybody who hasn't seen it, go and watch the YouTube video. After Whoa, this, huge removal. Mahosov. I mean, one would say why expose him when you could uh, have uh, not, yep. but the perfect defense actually probably doing him a, a disservice there. Right? Disservice, yeah. Him. And he, he didn't get the right three, three, three from eight, so uh, the ball is pretty easy to pick up. Transfer. I, and, uh, easy. Up. I will say, I will say pick that there is... Mm -hmm. uh, some space on the left side of the pitch that uh, can be taken advantage of. Yes. Uh, may maybe. Just, you might be right. Yeah, I don't understand. One in nine. The, the, this, I mean, this 1 in 36 pickup's horrendous, though, isn't it? And even the 1 in mm -hmm. 6 is bad because you have to re-roll it. Yes. But um, easy pickup handoff, isn't it? And then you're, you're golden. I guess you could yep. go with this and then try and go there and... And just screen like, like you could just go for the pickup with him because he's got sure hands. One, two, yep. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then go yep. back. That's a possibility. I mean, I it wouldn't be wouldn't surprise me too much if he was to hoof it at the wrestle in the middle and uh, see if he can get a bit further downfield. But I I don't think that's the right play. No, I think I think probably the right play is to uh, yes, yeah, to yeah, you're, you're uh, pick right. it up yeah, and he's go just back. picking up and fuck off back there. Yeah. Because you've got eight turns, haven't you? And like, I guess it sucks if he gets wizarded, is the thing. Mm -hmm. So maybe, but then you just can't afford to use, spend the reroll on the pickup. That's the that's the problem. Uh, that's a good one, PC. All all famous Belgians are made up: Poirot, Tantan, and Jean Claude Van Damme. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
And uh, and of course, uh, Philippe Albert, if you remember him. That name's really familiar. And he used to play for Newcastle back in the no, 90s. Then, no, then no, I don't. And he was well, very good. Was he, yeah? Mm. I mean, Caroline, don't, don't feel guilty for not knowing the players of Newcastle in the 90s. <laughs> yeah. Well to, be, well, to be fair, Newcastle were actually okay in the 90s, right? Yeah, they were pretty good, yeah. Beat Manu 5 0 once. Mm hmm. And Philippe Albert got a great goal. He scored the. I, don't know, he didn't, I think he might have scored the fifth. It might be like the third or something. He scored it. He scored a lovely goal. Good for him. Hmm. Well, but nowadays it seems everybody can be the Man U five 0 or six 0 or whatever. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Not as impressive today beating beating five 0 but back then it was it was unbelievable. This is not as safe as he could have made it. No. But maybe he wants it uh, to be a little bit unsafe, you know, to encourage Andy to use the wizard and then, you know, yep. a little yep. bit unsafe to, you know, maybe bait the wizard a little bit. Just of course. Somebody to exclamation mark easy. Yeah. But you know, the difference between baiting the wizard and uh, losing the game. <laughs> Yeah, it's a fine line. It's a fine <laughs> line to tread. A fucking fine line. <laughs> To be honest, that's that's why I tend to never bait the wizard. Um, not intentionally, anyway. <laughs> there are times when I've tried to make a nine. I think it's one of these things that people, you know, we make a mistake. Says, "Oh, that was on purpose." You know, that that was on purpose. That yeah, was, yeah, yeah. Uh, it was a wizard bait, obviously. Oh, yeah. ooh, bait ooh. Is a one in nine as well. Ooh, yeah, he might not re-roll it. Ooh, it does. Yeah, it does. Doesn't get him, but um, yeah, I wouldn't have hated the evening there. Yeah, he, may, he probably wanted more than 15 seconds there, did Devo? Yeah. It's one of those situations where, you know, he he, he should have spent more time thinking before he made that block. Yeah, so, I, think it, I, think, I think it was a thinking block, is yeah. I think what it was, yeah. Yeah, maybe, but he... Sure, he I'll just take this block and see what happens afterwards. Yeah, he had to, and that, that's what I hate about these 15... I hate it so much, you've got 2 minutes 20 seconds. He should be able to think for 2 minutes about rerolling that block if he wants, shouldn't he? It's fucking mm. terrible. Like, that's his turn time. That's mm -hmm. what the turn time's for, to think if you're going to re-roll that block. And it's idiotic that you've got to think for a minute before you make the block on a 1 in 9 chance of it having, you know, your thinking time being worthwhile. It's fucking terrible. Mm. Goes here, doesn't it? Get, get some. Proud. How bad? Not oh, dead. Devo bamboozled. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Like, uh, chat in silence. Yeah. Chat in silence. <laughs> Hellboy is already composing a ballad. About <laughs> the... He doesn't game, Hellboy. <laughs> How is he not dead? What's going on? <laughs> yeah, you're you're right, PC. Um, the shaders all around the ball and all the good guys all up the top. Yeah, but it means you can get the good one, the good ones can get off now, can't they? Well, now they can so. transition. Oh, James, going there with the heavy hits, you know. I've called Hellboy a lot of things, but I will never dare to call him that. <laughs> he doesn't write the, uh, the 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 music, does he? But uh, he usually writes the lyrics. Store has done done quite a few, like at least two that I know of, <laughs> three that I know of, maybe it's four. The store done four? Maybe store's done four or more. The it's a store done always one. behind everything. Yeah, Sat has done one. Yeah. I've done one. Um, a bit. And Skuro's done a bit. And uh, then there's, uh, there's someone else did one. This is a terrible blitz decision. A terrible blitz decision? Well, he doesn't get, get anywhere from it. All he was doing was just hitting the... The best player. Yeah, fair enough. Fair <laughs> I quite enough. like that flip. And then if you if you push him, you get to move away. Off him and gets tackled. Yeah, I mean obviously dodging off him sucks. But like you know, you've won in nine right with a blitz, which is pretty unlucky. Yeah, fair enough. You've got a good chance of powering him with mighty blow. I am doing a classic uh, necro play, blitzing and having to dodge afterwards. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you've got all this space to go to, like you know. So yep. I quite like just blitzing him, and then it saves you dodging off tackle. Oh, so he blitzed him so that he could get off the top. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, it, just, it was just a super unlucky one in nine. 
I just didn't like it. So they've both they've both rolled a pretty unlucky one in nine, right? Uh, yeah. Obviously, Lumi had to re-roll his. Maybe he didn't have to make the blitz, but I like making that blitz. These two can dodge off non-tackle. And then eventually he's going to have to dodge him as well. At the end. He is still traumatized from blitzing the best player. Yeah. Blitzing the best player. Usually, I mean, you know, Lee wins that game. Yeah. Some amount of the time, doesn't he, by blitzing that strength five vamp? Yep. But. As it happened, <laughs> it lost him the game. What a gamble from uh, uh, Elio was that. But, uh, yeah, the, this, is, uh, this would be fine if it wasn't for the wizard. Yeah. Because I'm not sure where this guy goes. It's still somewhat fine, isn't it? It's grand. It just depends. Like, if the fireball gets the three of those guys down, then, you know. There's no edge I suppose the wolves the are wolves. still, yeah, the wolves are still tied up, and yeah. there's, there's no edge four for Andy, so it's no. not like he can swan in and fuck mm -hmm. off with it reliably. For sure. I mean, he can now put the fleshes very easily in the in two elves. It's a fleshy, you know, the one say uh, the two at the top. Yeah. And the two at the bottom, just movement one uh, one square, and I'll keep them busy. Yeah. And then rush the, the rest of the team to do all the stuff. <laughs> Literally, I am. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, there isn't very much behind or in front of the ball. Yeah, that's very true. Everything's over here, so it's pretty, it's pretty safe this turn. Um, and yeah, Andy needs to pull back, doesn't he? He needs to get his fast boys out. You want like you want basically to be parallel to the offense. I always feel. So you like you know, the, the fleshies here and other stuff here, all the fleshies here and other stuff there. And it's going to be a struggle to make that happen, really. Well, there is one of the responsive pieces uh, not being very responsive. Mm, and neither is the, the other one going to be. No, unless he decides to blitz off it. Yeah, so that was the plan. No, this isn't a blitz either. No, no, just punch. You need something holding here as well, right? Like that's the thing you you want to be parallel. So you do need something holding there, but holding it with your fastest players isn't. Yeah. Maybe this isn't great. You'd probably more like just be behind the screen, like center. But he, he's got time to sort that out anyway. Yeah, fair enough. There is always time to do a bit of banging. I mean, banging is is very important to winning games of football. For sure. Yes, yes. Uh, that's why the best, uh, the most difficult stat to to get is the banger one. <laughs> See, yeah, just what Fine said, getting them both in. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that was <clears throat> that was very easy to see. <laughs> to see because it was next to each other. You know, you know. The, mm -hmm. My. Uh, no blood ball knowledge, you know, is uh, was enough to see that. <laughs> I think I would have liked one of the fleshies here, so like blitz this guy and try and get a fleshy there, but it wasn't easy. And like, so now he's basically letting him through here, probably. Yeah. And then you can maybe screen this off and hold it for a bit, but they well, can get the walls back. The, yeah, yeah, he's still got the. the the, the, the guard the, the guard and the tackle to come around so he may even go for the GF fight get this guy in and bring him and drop him on top oh no he's going for nah, this they're, not, they're not going there because he'll get, he'll get smashed by the main goal tackle yeah for him oh ah, speaking of him yeah that's much better than getting mm. in front especially if you get the removal <laughs> yep instant removal and uh, yep now the equi the equidiometer has swung to ninety point seven four in Andy's favour. <laughs> it's it's like what they've got in this NFL fantasy football. They've literally got like percentage chance of you winning and stuff. And like I was about sixty percent earlier. Now I'm about, now I'm down to forty eight percent. And it's uh, 
it's yeah. pretty good. It's pretty good. You can have the win probability all the time. And yeah, mine's just got fucked because someone's got a touchdown. Dalvin Cook, scumbag. Dalvin <laughs> Cook's a pretty good player. Well, fuck that guy. <laughs> <laughs> Two rushing TDs, scumbag. Mm -hmm. 23 points he's got. My running back's got three. <laughs> Who's your running back again? Well, this this particular one, James. My, to be fair, Leonard Fournette has got uh, 22, so or well, yeah. 23 now, so we, we've got equal on that one. Cool. But, um, you know. Oof. He's predicted 102. Point seven nine, and I'm pretty good at 102.02. So it's it's Ooh. it's nip and tuck. It's very nip and tuck still. Well, who's my home playing? Uh, Las Vegas Raiders. Mm. Mm. So yeah, that's the thing. Because he didn't get in the way here, then mm -hmm. uh, we get a total switch around, don't we? And everything's going to be here ish. Yep. Yep. If he, I mean, there's, there's, there's definitely some two pluses to roll to get him around there. But uh, yep, he's doing the old uh, reversing the field, as uh, as PC would call it. Yeah, I mean, elves don't roll, don't don't fail two pluses. So it's, mm. it's definitely happening. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they never fail two pluses, do they? Absolutely. No, never. never. Yeah, never. Wants to hold the sideline with this guy, I think. Yes. Yeah, so. Because the wolves can still get back. To, yeah. I'm maybe he's going to try and punch here. Yeah, he's just going to try and punch here, maybe. But then that's... Mm, I don't know. Not ideal. It's not easy, is it, with that guard? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Fair enough, Ali Raider. I'm hoping Mahomes puts up 40 fantasy points so I actually win. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> yes, should be enough. But he sure does love getting players punched, doesn't he? Yeah, he does, yeah. Doesn't play at high else like I do, but then he qualified and I didn't, so there you go. For sure, yep. Yeah. <clears throat> Chuntner always does really well on ladder, doesn't he? So, the, you know, this kind of high, high octane style definitely works. Yeah. It would have worked versus Dave, or if it all worked. Indeed. It's not as if it's failed because Devo's good. <laughs> yeah, like five or six times he gets away, he gets away with it, right? Yeah. I think Devo is uh, not letting him score or split his team. I think he's going to come back now. I think this guy is going to come back and blitz this one. Mm -hmm. I think the, the frenzy tackler is going to get the... Uh, hit by the frenzy tackler. Yes. Yeah. The goo will run all the way around. So he's got to go. Okay. Well. Okay. The wolf can do it then. Yeah. The wolf does it. There you go. Easy peasy. Will be this the third kill for the, the player. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Ooh. Oh, I don't like that. I mean, it, okay, no, no. it doesn't stop the guard on the follow-up hit, but I would have done the big hit first, see what happens. Yes, just in case of the best call. Does so or the ghoul, maybe? Mm. As it does allow the flashy to get around the top, though, does it, around the side, doesn't it? Yeah, it just go up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah maybe he should have gone out. Yeah, maybe he's move out there. Because he can get the he can get the ghoul and the flashy down the down the such the sideline now. But then he that, he can't get anyone down the side if he doesn't power this guy. <laughs> sure. Eleven twenty will go to <laughs> Yes, I mean, yeah. Obviously, Dave was far better than the average CCL opponent, but like it still would have worked versus Dave or most of the time in this game, as mental as it was. Because it is high risk, high reward, isn't it? So like, it was it was a very bold strategy, but the. Uh, <laughs> Very valid. 
arguably better versus Devo than an average CCLer because you know probably beat the average CCLer no matter how he plays. <laughs> Whereas maybe this was the way to beat Devo. Maybe if he just plays it passively, uh, no, they, they, Devo just is loses. sweating this game. He's, he's not uh, in a happy place <laughs> yeah. right now. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Maybe, I mean, maybe he's, maybe he's, but you know, this game is taking. He, he has to use all his uh, focus and everything. Yeah, it's not simple. Like you know, if 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 Luminous gets to overtime and receives, even with one reroll, it's you know, it's almost certain loss, isn't it? Like elves are elves are too good on offense. So yeah. you know, Devo has to has to force the early score. He has to he has to get a chance to score himself because. So we've got the big foul coming in here. Hmm. Um, gonna have to do it with the guard though, more than likely. Yeah, which means he doesn't get the tackle up down. So maybe he, maybe he won't. Maybe he'll just foul with the tackle. Maybe he'll foul with the white. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Or a fleshy. <laughs> or a gowl. <laughs> yeah, the gowl. Yeah. Did you like that gowl in your face? <laughs> Yes, he still has a whiz, but the um, you just can't see it here. Um, but like he, he's got to, he's got to use it, hasn't he? Like it, it can't just be a threat. Like he has to stop the score or force him in early. Mm -hmm. Like he's got to do I one don't of those two things. Luminos have felt intimidated by the fact that uh, Devo has a wizard. He's just been carrying with his uh, good player and mm -hmm. all that. So, just a stun, but an important one, nevertheless. We've got four players over here. Maybe you can yeah. run over here and try and get these guys down to make the stall over here. But no, instantly just banging. <laughs> punches. Instantly just non a blockless block. Yeah. Instantly He's setting take the punches, a and if block. he uses his reroll, he'll score more than likely. Yeah, I, didn't, I, I already hate this turn because I, yeah. I feel like going over here and screening this best. Yeah. I guess blocking blocking the tackle is good, but it's two players, isn't it? It's two players that could have been doing something. Two players. All you only need the, to keep one on him. He's not going to do, you know. A... Although I guess this could be a blitz, right? This could be a blitz. And then tag the. I mean, uh, put uh, him, yes. Uh, under the fleshy. The square is yeah. under the fleshy. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. You could go to there, or you could dodge out with him and then hit him with him, and then come back and then move him all the way over there. Yes, he a hundred percent of swap sides, which in a military military history is called doing an Italy. Oh, <laughs> 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 yeah, I think he's just scoring by the looks of this. Yeah, yeah it seems a bit of a mistake. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, well, I think scoring's wrong because now Devo scores in five and wins. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think so. Unless, you know, Lumi, in a complete reversal of uh, his otherwise uh, exemplary past, will um, base the shit out of Devo and hope he makes a mistake. Yep, that is what and, he will do. Uh, yeah, it is. <laughs> You can bet your well, house makes, that that's, that's well, what makes you think that. <laughs> but now the equity ometer is ninety one point eight four. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I definitely think going over there. Five turns is a lot more than four. I know it sounds stupid, but it is. It, it just gives you so much more freedom. And like yep. you know, Devil's got to try and score. Like if you give him three turns, he has to try to score because he doesn't want to like lose on a fifty-fifty, right? If you give him three turns to score, he almost definitely uses his wizard. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, get the riot classic. He's still got eleven players somehow, but obviously that's a huge player to be down. Mm -hmm. um, but two players out for Devil, but he's still got the full eleven. But that's I mean that's a down a white is you know. A bit tricky, you know. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna play like a loony, isn't he? Again, uh, loony. Loony should it's call the, himself uh, loony. Yeah, <laughs> it's the uh, it's the white he wants to level as well. 
Yes, yeah, that's but, true. Uh, He'll just get the MVP we'll anyway. The MVP, yeah, <laughs> exactly what I was going to say. <laughs> yeah, it's a big yeah, favourite now. Yeah. But, you know, even five turns, this is still, you know, it took him five turns to stabilise in the first half. So there's a decent chance that, that Lumi loses two or three guys here, but stops the score, I guess. Are we gonna, yeah, the Blitz is obviously amazing. There will be a Blitz here, and... Uh... We are always a blitz. There's been a lot of kickoffs today, and I haven't seen a blitz yet. Mm, good point. Just so uh, obviously, that means there are more chances of the blitz to. I mean, that's just how. That's because just that's how yeah. uh, dice and. Uh, yeah. 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 Exactly. So there's somewhere in America, there's a man saying, "Ten me." Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? It's funny how that works, you know. And uh, in, they always say, in, like, you know, what's it called? Uh, uh, what's it called? Like, but not blackjack, but roulette. People always oh, yeah, like yeah. people always think in roulette, like if there's been like seven reds in a row, people are like black stew, black stew. It's like if anything, the fucking thing is is misbalanced, so reds more likely. That's the only sensible conclusion to draw. Yeah. <laughs> So no no blots. Uh, not nice very weather. deep either. Not even very deep. No. I would have liked to have aimed even deeper than that. You really want to separate the ball carrier from the line, don't you? This, this do, yeah. can get right up there and safe in one turn. I mean, really was, had to uh, be deeper there. Oh, it was maybe, a, it was a six on the scatter tried, rush. Maybe he tried to go deeper, but oh no, was the guys. Uh... Yeah. Oh, it doesn't give us the d6. Scatter one, scatter three. Six. Oh, there it is. Three. So it went one, not two. Yeah. Zero, uh, one, it goes one, doesn't it? And then... Yeah. And then the uh, changing weather added an extra scatter. Yeah, okay. Yeah. No, zero. If you roll a one, it doesn't scatter. And if you go two or three, you round it down, so it would have gone one square. So I think you should have put it like right in back. here. Yeah. I suppose he would wanted it in range in case he got the blitz, because... Yeah. But who cares? Like, just splitting, yeah. splitting is too powerful. You have sure. to have them split. Mm -hmm. Playing the way he plays, anyway. <laughs> when you know you're going to base every single player on your opposing team, <laughs> you definitely want the gal on its own back there, <laughs> unprotected. Uh, he does indeed, Robino. That's what. That's exactly why we were looking at it, because uh, and why we were saying, you know, it should have been a bit deeper, but. Uh, I, I think he was going for um, within range of his own players. Mm. Which I think uh, is a bit greedy. For the Blitz. It is, yeah. He for was aiming for the Blitz. Yeah, he was just... Yeah. Yep, there's no like tackle back. Sitting there shouting 10 me. Isn't it weird? Because Dave was already like, you know, I mean, maybe he didn't see the, the game that Lumi played against Vade. But he's already mm. seen how how Lumi played the first half, like the first drive. You've got to anticipate that he'll, he'll continue playing that way. Um, 100%. So yeah, I would have very much like this this tackler to be like here if I was under. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like he's gonna foul here as well. Yeah he is gonna foul yeah. I suppose he's you know, hasn't really had anything to use his foul on uh, yet uh, for a, a good few turns and still has the bribe in his pocket so, so there you go so Andy's Andy's just stranded himself <laughs> yeah. interesting strategy Cotton not what I would have done I would have brought everybody back and this would yeah. have gone forward and I would have had a big blob of men around the ball and Andy is actually Ooh. just just you know he might he has kicked here effectively because he's gone there and gone yeah back. so there you go that's pretty crazy just get rid of this shitty line elf. Way higher. given, yeah. So get to seven. Is it double fours? It's not no. double fours. So two removals, but he's still going all in, obviously. No doubt from anybody. He's going to tag, tag these two. He's going to tag the two tacklers. He's going to tag the wolf, and he's going to get what players he can around. <laughs> We've seen enough luminous games now to know exactly what he's going to do. Come on, play blue ball like it's 1996. Yeah. Yeah, the D3 on the kick skill rounds down, yeah. So a 1, it doesn't scatter at all. 2 to 3, it goes 1. 4 to 5, it goes 2. And on a 6, it goes 3. Yeah, that's Ooh. correct. Yep. I correct. thought it was an actual D3, so 1, 2, 3. No, it's not. It's well, slightly, it's, slightly it's, different. Because you can't of have course, a... Of course, it's his workshop, you know. He has to change yeah. the things. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, I don't know why they've done that, but they have. They they made it slightly different for kick. 
I guess it's kind of cool that they made it slightly different. Isn't it? Uh, slightly. Just, you know, another rule that they can put in the book. Uh, I'm sure there's probably a valid reason for it. Yes, another rule in the book. Yeah, another rule in the book. <laughs> and everybody knows that against Warsaw is very good at making rules, like, you oh, know, for example, the links of amazing. Botan, you know, that were so well designed <laughs> that they were modified before launch. Yeah, I watched a YouTube this morning about how the new Luminath Realm, Realm Lords are going to be exactly the same issue, so... It's not just uh, 40k, it's pretty much everything. One, one could say that, you know, some playtesting should be welcome, but... Uh -huh. Well, they just fired all their playtesters. Mm. Uh, they fired all of their playtesters for the world involved in 40k because uh, they were uh, annoyed about leaks. Yeah. Sorry, is that for real? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you don't want to get rules leaked, do you? And then people not buying rules. Like, the, own, the rules only exist to be bought, not to be good. Yeah. <laughs> Correct. Yeah, you just want, to, you want people to buy the codex. Yeah, you want people to buy the codex because you want the people to buy the miniatures. Yes, yes exactly. Yeah. So I don't think, you know, the, having the codex, which, by the way, is going to be leaked the first day it goes on sale. So, you know, <laughs> people can, you know, there is these things that can scan text and put on the indent or something like that. Yeah. So well, having they, the leaks beforehand is not a problem. So there, there weren't any... So all of the playtesters who were working on the squats on leagues were, were all fired. And uh, that was before the thing came out. And I still had a copy of the rulebook two weeks before it was released. <laughs> Holy shit, so, he played sensibly. He did, really sensibly. Wow. What is this? This is the, the other Luminous. <laughs> <laughs> what on earth? And now Andy's I mean, sensible. I'm bamboozled by the game's worst of decision. I mean, I work with companies and uh, you know, video games with playtesting and all that in projects that, you know, that could move hundreds of millions. And the leaks that are actually brutal because it could be the, the end of the game or mm. something like that, you know, so mm -hmm. actual things. But the rules, like, hey, there you go, mate. Yeah, for have sure. Have them, have them. Especially when it gives people who actually know what rules are like uh, time to process them. Also, but uh, the other thing is from those people I know who were involved in, in uh, testing the rules for uh, some of the other codexes. Uh, most of the stuff was wrong uh, when it was finally published. Uh, for example, the Eldar book, um, one of the units, one of the Harlequin, it, immediately the Harlequins were the thing that came out of the Eldar book because they were so ridiculously busted. Because uh, one of the unit entries was, uh, it used to be able to get three of them because they were a fast attack choice. Or, sorry, a heavy support choice, and uh, instead of there being one of this uh, unit in uh, the slot, you could buy zero to three of them, because mm. uh, they wanted to sell nine models, and uh, they were absolutely fucking busted. <laughs> and uh, the playtesters I talked to uh, said that they were zero to one in the versions that they were playing with. There you go. And uh, yes, PC, maybe conservative is what I should have said rather than sensible. But yes, this is a this is a more conservative player from Luminous, isn't it? But yes, I thought maybe he's going balls to the wall. Did have more merit than the first half. Yes, certainly. But, you know, it's, it's all right, isn't it? Because he was so disconnected as well, wasn't he? Like, the, the ball carry was down here. Like, mm -hmm. I much preferred going all in then. Playtesters are idiots, yeah. yeah. I mean, that is also, to be fair, yeah, Hammers. <laughs> to but be fair, maybe, Games Workshop maybe, don't care about rules. Maybe they found everything, said everything, and the company did nothing. It's also very common in uh, video game play testing. You know, the testers find uh, problems, and yeah, they never get solved. Yeah. And they could have been shown a different set of the rules that they play tested. Like, they might have never been or been, and they might have never read the rules either. You know, like <laughs> like that, yeah. that one, the multiple re-rolls. Nobody reading it for the first time you know, even thought you could use multiple rerolls because they were just so used to the previous rules, right? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly the wrong defense both times. No, I think I think it was fine. Honestly, the first half, like, you know, God knows how many times he wins that a, a big a percentage of the time. The first half, the first half, there was. He was so unlucky. Like he, he put the guard in the wrong place. Like I'm sure he put the guard. That was I think that was just literally like a misclick or whatever. Like surely he was meant to put the guard on the wolf so he could two D blitz through, 
rather than one deeper yep. through. So like, and if he'd had that guard, then he would have had two D on the ball instead of one D on the ball the next turn yep. and stuff. But um, so I think he just made a mistake. But I think yep. I think it was fine to go balls to the wall. Like it really was because he's on a clock. Like his his team is is it's not worse, but it's it's going to get ground down the longer the match goes on, isn't it? And like you know he's he's going to get hit by sniped by the mighty blow claw and. You know, he's probably... Uh, and this isn't bad either. I mean, like, he does have three turns to score, so, like, staying in front of him and all the rest of it is kind of fine as well. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But then he immediately bases up this guy and he's going to go take a hit on this wrestler. Oh, no, he's going for the garter, obviously, because it's a tackle. Yeah. yeah, it's true. I mean, I agree that I said the same thing, Pixie. Yeah, he should have he should have, uh, should have pulled back. Um and he just left like four players round round a wolf, which was terrible. But I think I think the initial half was was fine, but I thought the second half was bad. Yeah, and I don't think this is necessarily bad. This is just conservative, no. isn't it? I, and again, I, I I do think it it's not unlikely that he got a bit freaked out by the fact that the the wolf fouled and killed that guy so early <laughs> in the turn. I think I think that kind of got to him. The problem is against the wizard. This is a good chance of this not being good enough, isn't it? That's the problem. So yeah, 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 yeah. that was more reason to go balls to the wall now, yeah. because Andy will use the wizard here, you know, to win. Yeah, because it'll win him the game. Yeah. Oh, that's it fizzles. Yep. Yeah. Uh, that's uh, beyond uh, the control, you know, of Andy. Well, it's in his control because he's one doing the role, you know. So. Mm. Everybody knows that the rolls can be affected by your uh, clicking speed. Yeah. Second Ed, yeah, Second Ed was a completely different game, but you could use multiple re-rolls in the turn, yeah. And, like, players had re-rolls and teams had re-rolls, and you could re-roll kills and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, I mean, I think you can get away with it in this game. Yeah, 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 I think you can get away with it in this Hmm. Not easy, this is it to get forward. No, it isn't. Because you can't use the whiz yet. Mm-hmm. Yes, because the option he has is going left, but that's a very strong uh, elf presence yeah, those there. Are, those are really good and, elves over there, and right and is right, the shit elves. You, you, the shit elves, but you need to move a lot. You do. Mm. And your pieces are not that fast. Yeah. Maybe you put in the guard here and try and punch these, see if you power them both. <laughs> mm -hmm. Even if you do, this guy's in the way a bit. Yeah. But at least then you have your, um, you have your blitz through. Yeah. I have to say that uh, usually I'm happy of not having to play Blood Bowl, but I'm particularly happy of not having to play this game of Blood Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because this is really rough. Yeah. It's like, it's like it's like the games versus Chunter, isn't it? People generally, you know, like Elliot, don't enjoy playing against Chunter because you know he puts all of his puts all of his players in your face, and you've got to deal with them. And if you don't deal with them, I things get so very tricky. Being obsessed with rats that you've actually gone on holiday, okay. running up out there, or we shall play and playing qualifying yep. with the team. Oh, that was uh, just just side playing oh, more right. fucking rats. What the fuck? Why the fuck would anyone play that much fucking rats? Jesus Christ. Huh. <laughs> at the end, oh wow, there you go. There goes the guard. Imagine if he'd done something useful before that happening instead of just standing in the way like an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> no follow though, so there's not a huge amount of stuff he can get out of that. I would have, I'm surprised at the lack of follow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, because the follow is, uh, still gives him the hit with the wrestler on the, on the wrestler, mm -hmm. so. <laughs> <laughs> so no sidestep on this boy. He just manages to shove him a bit away, but it looks like he's almost playing for overtime, lads. I he's was got a lot so... of work to do. He has got a lot of work to do. I mean, he, he, you know, he, he has to he has to play for the touchdown. He has to he has to try and force yep. something because if he goes to overtime, he loses. Like. Almost well, guaranteed. Well, like if he loses the toss in overtime, if he loses the toss in overtime. He's fucked. Yeah, it doesn't like, matter. He's no got reason. six elves. It doesn't matter. No reason not to to go at it. Yes, because if he loses the toss, he has to decide. Uh, you know, because Luminous could go for try to one turn if he has the chance. Mm. Mm. 
because he has players good enough to you know do a sensible uh, one turner. But if yeah. you set up versus the one turner, you're not setting up very well versus a two turner. Mm. A high elves are very good. A two turner used to be the best until the bloody pro elves came, you know, <laughs> with their nerves of steel. Yeah. Shit. I'm getting wrecked in the. Uh, I'm getting wrecked in the old. Uh, fantasy football. Fantasy football. Yep. Yeah. Eighteen points behind. The older fantasy football, not blue ball. Yeah, just get good, like. Yeah, just get good. My tight end got zero points. <laughs> oof. oof. Big oof. Last week he got 31. <laughs> this week he got none. <laughs> oh, I think you just keep out what you're doing, right? You just dodge these guys back and make a nice wall across the middle of the book, across the whole pitch. Yeah, yeah, hold the, hold the middle. Hold the middle, because he's got, and, and more over this side, because he's got the tackle of that side. Yeah. So, so, like, more like around here is where you hold. And then, um... Yeah, exactly, PC, I think. You know, you've got to be wary of the of the, of the the elf counter score, but the elves didn't threaten a counter score. They just walled up, didn't they? So, yeah, I, I believe he should have gone more balls to the wall trying to get through. Because this is, I mean, elves are not easy to break through, unless you try. <laughs> oh, and, and also there is a lot of side step there, you know, so yeah. <laughs> trying to break through could end very, very bad. Yeah, but he, he had he had to go for that heavy engagement um, to then get value from the wizard as well. Mm -hmm. We'll see now then if he wizards this turn. Because he could. He could bolt this guy, blitz this guy. Yep. And yep. get everyone through, but like, how does he even cover? Through, yeah. How does he cover the ghoul? That's the problem. Mm. Like, he just doesn't have the movement to go with. And he's barely got the movement from the ghoul. The ghoul needs uh, a chance. Yes, I was thinking that the ghoul is uh, very far from the thousand line. Mm. Hmm. Now, I wonder if just directly behind, he sh I think he should have gone <clears> directly <throat> behind, so at least if he yep. bolted him and blitzed him, he'd still have to... No, he wouldn't have to dodge. No. Because he'd got... No, yeah, yeah, he would if he... No, he wouldn't if he... You, if he pushed him, he'd have to power him. A push wouldn't be good enough, would it? Whereas now, a push will be... I wonder if he'll bolt. I wonder if he'll bolt this guy. He does. does indeed, you were yeah. absolutely right. Mm. And doesn't get him down, but he can. Hmm. So fleshing into the corner. I, I think, think he can just... put the tackler. Uh, just this. Uh, the tackler yeah. also tagging the in that square. Yes, that square where is the fleshy. I thought maybe the tackler could be there just to put tackle on that the uh, frenzy uh, side yeah. step piece. Yeah, you probably blitz with him, yeah, because then yeah, you yeah. get him out for sure. Mm -hmm. Oof. Oof. Needs a removal now. Oh, he might have to re-roll this. Because he's used God. the whiz, he's used the whiz this yeah. turn. So he's, yeah, you yeah. re-roll it. Yeah. He re-rolls it, gets it. Gets the armor Oof. break. He got the removal? No. No. <laughs> if he got the removal there. <laughs> but now he having... can't GFI. No, he can't, yeah. So he has to leave the GFI for next turn. But at least he'll have both of the wolves in scoring range. Yeah, and he can get the... See, I didn't really like the the the, wolf, the zombie there as much in terms of I'd, I would have rather had the, the the fleshy coming through to here because now he's only got a, mm -hmm. got a zombie through, but it, like it's fine, isn't it? It's not, it's, yeah. It doesn't really matter much. And he can bring the tackler can come all the way on the top as well. High elves don't have a scorer. No, they've only got one turn. No. They do not have a scoring oh, threat, so we can go to. Yeah, so I guess he can do the GFI. Yeah, yeah you can just push it, yeah. But he hasn't got a reroll for it. He'd rather do the GFI next time when he's got a reroll. So I exactly, still don't yeah. think you do the reroll this year. No, because you leave the GFI. Because it, it would be fine if it wasn't, you know, the only piece on your team that has, doesn't have reach out. <laughs> yeah. Well, if, if you, just if you had no reroll, if you had no reroll at all left, then you might as well do it this turn. Mm -hmm. But. Um, but the fact he's got yes, a reroll for next Why to have the reroll? Yeah. 
Ooh. Is he going? Uh, I think he's going to foul the tackler on the floor. Yeah, yeah so he's only going there to use Leech, this Leech. fleshiest part of the cage. Yeah, Leech just called that as well. Uh, not terrible. Because now he's got two GFIs next turn. That is interesting. And that yeah. also opens up punching him. Ah, no, I guess he can go left or right. One, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, he's still got six, so he can go like one, two, three, four, five, six. But yeah, it's probably. Yeah. You can blitz one wolf, tag the other one and stuff. Park the tackle on the uh, on the on the left hand side, just on uh, next to the stripper. Just keep him based. Yeah. So that both of the guys, the lads, have to dodge through tackle, unless he starts with the one D. This guy, could, yeah, the tackle can get to here. It's not as it's not it's not as good, is it? Uh, it's okay. Yeah, no, it's fine. Yeah, I don't know. Better than nothing. I'd rather just keep the guy tied down so that he has to take a three. Yeah, like put him in there. Yeah. But you could put him behind there, and then like this zombie could GFI. Oh, well, he's yeah, just used him. as an assist. So. Yeah, guard for this guy. Oh, he's already got guard. Mm. Just and he's also, I guess, he's got the blitz. He's got the blitz with him potentially next turn as well. Like he yep. can't, he can't tackle, yep. tackle it now. So you blitz one wolf, and and you wall off in front of the six, your six players. Pretty much. Easy peasy. Yeah, I mean this. The, yeah, this the ghoul. Hard. The ghoul uh, cannot afford to go laterally. Mm -hmm. Yeah, bolder than Fowler. Yeah, you're yeah. right. <laughs> that, 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 the guy goes, oh. Yeah. oh my god, the Hallyu Ball. What is this? What is this? The doctor. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, did uh, Andy pitch the player he killed to establish a uh, dominance? Oh, that's a good point. Uh, he yes, I done. think. Yeah, it's probably this one. Yeah, it is, yeah. <clears throat> That's it, you know, mind games, very interesting. Very good, always established dominance. Using the same mini, it was tabletop, you know, using the same miniature. <laughs> yeah, my player now. <laughs> oh, he's mine now. <laughs> my player, yeah. <laughs> uh... I wonder if you try and blitz, like, knock this guy over. Because um, he's a better one to knock over, isn't he? Plus movement and tackle. So, like, he's the, he's the best one to knock down. Yep. And then tag the other two. Mm. And you tag all three, right? Blitz him and then tag all three. Pretty tricky hitting that guy up. with the. Uh, pretty hit, pretty tricky hitting that guy because of the sidestep, though, right? Well, yeah, that's the only thing. You get, I guess you put him in there and then blitz there. Yeah, and then blitz him the wrestle. And he comes in. And mm -hmm. comes in. Yeah, just tag everyone, I, I guess. I just think Luminous is thinking if he can manage to put the tackle on the ghoul, which he can. Yeah, yeah, yeah so this is better, because then you get a hit with Wrestle, and mm -hmm. then put the sidestep tackle on the ball. Yeah, yeah, fair play. Yeah. Thank you very much for the raid there, Glorious. No he, can block the, he can block the square, right, just by going down. Well, then he can then he can go in there, right? There's two places he can put the Oh, yeah, 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 here. for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't like that, actually, for Nando, because now, obviously, this means he wants to go there. That's interesting, because if he, if he had gone to here, mm. or I guess no matter where he goes, he can, he can base there. I don't think Lumi will screen. I think he'll tag, I think he'll tag all of the... Uh, he likes to tag, doesn't he? <laughs> but he can screen and tag, right? He can, he can, he can tag him with the tackler and then still screen. So yeah, this seems a pretty easy defense, really. Even despite the wizard coming in. Last turn. That was a lighter that I heard. Mm -hmm, sounded it. It was. It was my lighter going off, yeah. I'm 18 points behind. 
I need I need his running back to not produce, or his wide receiver, his tight end to not produce, and then I need Mahomes to like go off, <laughs> and, then, and then I might do all right. I mean, you know, Mahomes going off is definitely a thing that can happen. Correct. Jeez. You can tell he plays a little bit of rebel. <laughs> yeah. Still needs this big dodge for the boy. Yeah, imagine if he runs out of time and doesn't doesn't tag. Oh, lad. Oh, he's, got, he's got three seconds, it's fine. Gotcha. That's a greedy square. To be with, it's, uh, it's, it's lovely, yeah. And... This is not easy for Andy right now. No, it's very no, not really easy. It. No, this was the problem by by not going, not getting as much forward. Right, he did like even yeah. using the wizard, he didn't even go one further forward that he could have done. Um, you know, I think I think he like the wolves had the movement to to hold it one up, but then obviously it, he'd have had to roll more dice to get in behind. But I think he had to try and get one forward, so he'd have had the lateral movement. If he had the lateral movement, he could have he could have you know gone off and tried to get through here somehow. But now without the lateral movement, it's it's very difficult, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Like if you have the lateral movement, you just put in guard and you dodge in two D and then and then score like that. And okay, you've got, you're against tackle, but who cares? You know, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to double dodge anyway, so it doesn't make that much difference. But without it. I don't know what the flippy does, he's basically just spunked his wizard to no avail, unless he scores, hasn't he? Uh, thanks, team man. Yeah, you know it, bro. Team me there with the actual facts for sure. <laughs> yep. <Yeah. laughs> I'm watching high elves after all. I don't know what percentage Andy is to score now. <laughs> I think you were very optimistic there. Mm. Told you it was 86.1, not 86.3. But he's got the fifty percent if he wins the toss, right? So it was more he does, yeah. like seventy percent to win the drive. <laughs> yes, I mean even if he wins the toss, it's clear that the scoring is uh, hard because yes, the elves have lost players, but if the KO rolls of the elves are decent, yeah, he could get uh, you know a good amount of uh, players, and he loses the toss. That's, that's I wouldn't rule that for sure. Yeah. I mean, the the really big thing, like what he really needs to do is like, he, like if he hasn't already, he needs to drop the GG. But his big mistake, really, Lumi, was not playing Andy in round one. <laughs> exactly, yes. When uh, Andy's at his weakest. Exactly. Golem in Wolf it into three two two. I don't know how you do a three two two. Oh yeah, the two D there. Yeah, oh god, yeah, yeah. This is easy. Isn't it? All right, this is actually easy. <laughs> yeah, so it was fully easy. I don't know why I thought it was hard. This is easy. This this guy probably shouldn't have been here, right? This guy should have probably been there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because he can't go diagonally. That's the thing. He, he cannot go laterally. So this is a mistake by Lane. Yeah, that guy should have been behind. Yeah, this is this was fucking easy. I don't know why I thought it was hard. <laughs> probably you two saying it was hard. It was it was fully easy. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm terrible at football. I don't know why anybody's listening to me say anything. <laughs> Three, two, two. Yeah, this guy. This guy should have been. Yes. This guy should. There's still rolls to make, but yeah, yeah, they, yeah. Clearly, uh, Andy deciphered the the mystery here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was super easy. But yeah, th this guy had to be there. That was a mistake because he couldn't go laterally. This would have been good if he could have gone laterally. <clears throat> I mean, it's a pretty big three plus off. Yeah, three two two without a reroll. Three two two. Well, well not without without a skill reroll. Yeah. Three two two yeah, yeah. with a team reroll. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Once you get to twenty nine, you know, anything that's a little oh, bit hard. Oh, Thirty oh percent to not score. Oh my god. Dramatic pause. Oh, 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 oh. Unbelievable. Wow. Yeah, I don't know why he moved anybody else. Yeah, we do indeed time. have a third half. A third half, yep. 50-50. See who yeah. wins. Yeah. Let's see how goes the... Ooh, three oh, kills. Oh, Elves coming back. Yeah. No, no kills. Oh, 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 despite the, the despite the babe. Oh, the High Elves win the right. toss. Wow. Oh, my God. It's actually a game. 
It is. Oh, oh. Nine elves with the ball. <laughs> this was stressful. Yeah. And yeah, two rerolls to none. Oh my god. Craziness. This is wild. Badly There's going to be some eye rolling going on on the Devo channel. Badly hurt. So he's actually coming. He's actually coming through this almost untouched if he wins now, uh, Lumi. Holy moly! The chaos is unbelievable. Devo's uh, Palmer didn't come back, so he's definitely getting the MVP. <laughs> yeah. And uh, Lumi's dead guy, who's on the line, is uh, obviously going to get the MVP. Yeah. Wow, the equity meter is exploding. Yeah, it's it swung from ninety percent to Andy, <laughs> to then it was then he was at like eighty. Like he's still at eighty five, right? Because seventy percent to score, and then also fifty percent he wins the toss. So he was still like, even after using the reroll, he was still like eighty five percent to win more or less. And uh, now that's gone. So now <laughs> I don't know what percentage Lumi is. Pretty high, um, pretty high, high. It's high, yeah. It's pretty high, yeah. It's pretty high. He's got two rerolls. He's got a really fast boy, and uh, he hasn't got an edge five. So you know, it, you know, Andy is good at blood ball, but yeah. how mentally strong will he be after uh, what two hours, hour fifty of this? Yeah, it's um, been a while, hasn't it? And after after failing that relatively easy score. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I say that the elves. Andy did the self win, but Luminous also did a very good work most of the game. Yeah. Oh, that's that just brought Samba. <laughs> uh, so he was 77 to score that touchdown. Mm. And then 50-50 to get the uh, to win the toss if he failed it. <laughs> so he was still he was still very likely. About ninety percent to win there, and now he's probably you know eighty to Lumi maybe. Yeah. Maybe even more. Elves that can score any turn they want is very dangerous, but they're they're almost they're almost relegated to trying to score in two. Like they want to score in two mm -hmm. because time is still on their side. They're still they're still ten versus eleven. They're still like you know tackle mighty blow stand firm. On the opposing side, but I guess they do have two re rolls. So maybe they're not gonna, maybe they'll just try and score in like four or something and not go too crazy. <laughs> Life is easier as an elf, that's true. Isn't it? Yeah. But I mean, that was dream result from Lumi, wasn't it? Like, he, at the end of the day, he, he, he played, defended passively. And left Andy with a seventy-seven percent score and got away with it. But he, he did draw out the wizard, which, like, his way of defending guaranteed drawing out the wizard, I guess. Yeah. So there is that in a way. I mean, the thing is that, like, Andy not pushing meant that it was probably the right play. I mean, Plus, maybe. Like, he still had a seventy-seven percent to score, didn't he? He did. Yeah, yeah. But like, he didn't do anything about it. He didn't push forward. He didn't get himself in range. You know. Hmm. Made himself short so that he could get a foul off, do you know? Yep. Yes, but he also had the 77% because uh, Lumi put an elf in the wrong square, one square uh, in all in the other square that what you mentioned before, it would be much more difficult for Andy yeah. to score. So, you yeah, know, true. that's, that's yes. the level, you know, it's like one square wrong, you know, like. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, the Quatrex, yeah, if he'd gone, if he'd moved for the Quatrex, it would have been alright. The Quatrex, right? Yeah. See, the champ knows how to play football. Yeah, he certainly knows. As he proves every time he's in his channel, uh, Twitch TV, uh, Dimmy G, <laughs> when watch the champ life. Yep. Yeah. Underscore. Don't forget the underscore. Yeah, yeah underscore. underscore. You don't underscore. Yes, yeah, sorry. And uh, you can also uh, uh, watch his kitchen. Mm. <laughs> no guard though for Lumi, which is big, isn't it? It is big. Not it is big. Oh, a touchback though. He'll he'll enjoy that. That's not ideal. So straight on fast boy. It, it, it depends of uh, which team are you playing. Is not ideal. <laughs> Run the frenzy. Mm. Wait, what? I guess he doesn't want to hit with him. So 
But he's moving eight instead of eight, nine, but he's closer. To. He's closer though, yeah. right? That's the thing, he's closer. Okay. Ah, yes, yes, yes. He's moving eight and he's closer. And I think there is a... Uh, plan is just to go through here on a 1D anyway. Yeah. Yeah, wrestle. Yeah, and then screen off. And then screen off, yeah. Oof. And get to there. Mm-hmm. And then screen everything off, probably. Yeah, because both the wolves are on the same side as well, right? Yeah. So, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. You can, like, tag the tackler. Tag yeah. the other wolf. It's got all sorts of options here. One, two, three, yes. four, five, six, seven. GFI. Literally... It's, it's hard to cover this, this way, but then they haven't got... Block of the, right? Yeah, yeah, like I mean, tackle. I'm just noticing that he's got both of his wolves and the ghoul on the right on the same side. Yeah, I yeah. was, uh, yeah, yeah, I was like, uh, and the only two zombies. And I think he put his fleshes yeah, close to the right side, so you know they could react and made the left side the uh, screener stronger. I wonder if what Putting he could have done even right was dodged here and hit one deed this guy. <laughs> And then you can, then you, then you like, then you just, then you hundred percent win, right? Like this is harder because, you know, he's got something over here. But I guess even if he powers you, you're still, you're still okay, right? Yeah. I guess as long as you, as long as the wolves aren't there. Okay, he's just gonna, he's just gonna cage. He can, oh, you can fully cage, can't he? Yeah, he can. Yeah. No, yeah. Well, this is a bit dodgy though, because now he gets, now he gets to hit you with everything. Yeah, he's made them much more relevant than I would have liked. Yeah, quite like running. Really far. Yeah, away. all the way over would have been much better. But I mean, this is still really hard for Andy to stop, and this is like kind of it less is. rolls to to get yeah. things. You know, pretty safe. Imagine how good Dimmy must be. Exactly. I mean, uh, Dimmy beating a famous elf uh, coach like Purple Chest twice. Yeah, Indeed. it's pretty incredible. With money on the line both times. Oh, and 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 those because they're not even counted. So he's beaten he's beaten him for the money and the, and in the CCR. What a legend! Yeah. Ah, uh, but looking at looking at it, one of the games was against dwarves, so obviously PC very inexperienced with those being an elf. Okay, right, PC yeah, no fair play. Yeah. <laughs> Probably PC had barely played any dwarves ever. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice tag. Yeah. Probably go through here. Uh, maybe. Yeah, just just go through. Um, maybe just tag someone. Mm. Because like I don't know how much you actually get from like dodging from through, right? There. Or it's just like well, you get, he's you get another scoring stress, right? Yeah, but maybe just, yeah, but you don't need to put in a reroll, so chances are you just no, you over and do nothing. Like do you know what I mean? There's a good chance of you if you try a three three two. There's a good chance of you just achieving nothing. Whereas here, at least you've done something, no matter how pathetic yeah. it is. <laughs> maybe though, he could have like put it on you know here, so you'd have to hit with the fleshy yeah. uh, to yeah. clear the target. Yeah, fleshy. Yeah. But the, the gal can get right in front of these, and uh, and he can take out the the shit corner at the top. Yeah, and he can cut, yeah. This is I, I much preferred going over the side. Yeah, I really did as well. Just yeah. Roll more dice on this turn, so you've got less dice to roll next turn. Yeah, indeed. Is and the, it, that's uh, the thing. It's it's because he'd set up so badly. He didn't really get a, like he got away with it because he you know made them relevant in a way that when they weren't. Mm. Because that this this gal wouldn't have been able to reach them at all if they were over where, over on the right hand side. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I actually I I even like like not protecting it even against those zombies. Right, yeah. just run over there yeah. and then screen like here, screen yeah. here, <laughs> in an L shape so that the wolves can't get you. And then if he hits the if he hits the ball, even if he powers, like you just pick up with another elf and score anyway. So he's, he's just got completely collapsed on. Yep. Yeah, this was the problem about this YouTube cage. Yep. He's got no edge five. Nope. And now he's got a wolf sidestep wolf parked on top of him. And a gowl parked next to him. Yep, two sidesteps. They might as well come all the way in because he's got the movement right. Let's take the yeah, extra step. I, think he, I, guess one. I guess it's which one he wants to wear for the guard. Right. Yeah, fair play. 
now this stops this 1D. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and doesn't even take the extra hits. Now he's got him there to, like, because he's on his feet and not dead, he can come there mm -hmm. to cancel this assist and now or a blitz or something. Luminous hand off to the fast boy, or plus with a catch reroll. Yeah. And, and dodge and scores. 3 2, yeah. <laughs> but no awesome. tackle, though, so. <laughs> well, there is on the second one, yeah. No, I think he can go uh, all the way without the uh, tackle, going one square to the left. Oh, yeah, one, yeah. He, two, he could three, dodge four, and three. blitz this guy, and then he could hand off, and then go three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, GFI, GFI. It wasn't great I for mean, me. No, I didn't like the, just the YouTube. Nah, I think it's... I think running over there was better. Too conservative, <laughs> I think, for uh, Lumi style I don't know how the fuck he, I, like this is how I think he gets out honestly this dodge blitz and then four plus handoff yep. into a three two or maybe it's a three three two and to save the GFI depending if you use dodge on the first dodge I mean he, he has, has to a, get the wolf down though right he has a yeah. roll one two three four five I mean you can hit you can push him twice so you'll you'll get him out of the way yeah, perfect. Ooh, you kills. Okay. Grabbing uh, Chanter's uh, book of plays. <laughs> yeah. First roll. Yeah. He's very, he's very Chunterish, isn't he? Like, if Chunter played high elves, this would be it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I like it. I like uh, high elves uh, playing uh, aggressive, a I mean, in the face and doing things well, and all that. This know? is actually not terrible because now this is just a three plus handoff to no, to GFI, right? Or is, is it even a GFI? Just scores in alignment. All right, but then he's got no ta he's got no dodge, so it's like a three with no reroll and a three yeah. and two with no rerolls and a two as well. So like, is he going to block him and then? Like I don't I know what his plan. The rest of so his I plan is. Well, he was hoping he'd get the reverse one in nine or whatever, and even take the wrestle hit to knock him down, so then he wouldn't be there. Do you know? I just I don't know because it was a wrestle hit. Yeah, but, but like, yeah, yeah, yeah. even if he powers him, he's not doing anything over there. I still don't know what the rest yeah, of the yeah. play is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a one day. But what, that's, what's that's the play now? Thinking. Where does he go he... now? Wow. Like I just still don't, and I still don't understand what he's no, trying I to do. I don't get it. Yeah, I don't get it. I thought he forgot the uh, the side step. I just don't get it. I think this is a shit turn from him. Follow. I thought previous yeah. turn was shit. He, I think he this follows, is shit. and now the dodge is a three plus. Without tackle. Three, three plus, oh. four plus. Oh, yeah, three, yeah, no, three no, plus, no, four good, plus, no, three, no, three, three, no, three, no. three, two. No, no, now he's just doing the handoff, and, and oh, look, but he hasn't the used the blitz to clear this guy. Yeah. Uh, the play I said. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. And he oh. fails because he didn't because he didn't do it properly. So he should yeah. have just done this. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! And he's dead and he's lost. So there yeah. you go. Yeah, yeah. Well, he hasn't lost yet. He still has, he still has players. But um, in the yeah, general was, vicinity of the ball, but uh, this is uh, looking uh, yeah. very bad. Yeah. Yikes. That is a harsh penalty. Yeah, that is a very yeah, harsh penalty. Yeah, even if he wins, much, yeah. even if he wins from like he still could win. But um, yeah. wow, yeah, ten L's and two reels. That was yeah, a bit of a disgrace. That, yeah. yeah, if yeah. he wanted, he should have gone. Uh, well, obviously, now you know hindsight, hundred under. But yeah, they, they play we we said here, blitzing mm -hmm. the wolf, getting the wolf uh, out of the way, and then just uh, doing that. There was a lot of uh, rerolls. The catch reroll, the dodge reroll, the team yep. reroll. Yeah, I mean, he was, yep. he was uphilling and wandering, like a blockless wandy and a, and a wrestle uh, uphill. On a, like, a, 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 a yes. bludger, yeah. On a bludger. Yes. These the were like the bad stats, step. and he could have just yeah. 2 plus to 2D him. And yep. then this could have done stuff. And, mm. Eric, you, you know, it. it's been a long game. Might just not have seen it. Yep, true, true, correct. And then the previous turn was also like shit to uh, be in this situation, you know. But yeah, it's fair enough. It's two hours. It's game, uh, right? two hours, yep. uh, more than two hours of game. Uh... And everybody makes mistakes. And just because you can make a shit turn, you know, because you can play a shit turn doesn't mean you're shit at Blood Bowl or a bad human being. <laughs> There's no need for anyone to be upset. No. 
<laughs> oh yes, of course, Artemis. Yes, that's, that's why you didn't want the challenge. <laughs> Hello. <man. laughs> <laughs> and now everything comes crumbling down. Yeah, and he's got. Yeah, he he's, doesn't need the reroll because he's already got. No, he's got sure the sure hands. Sure hands, yeah. Fatigue. So was a pretty big one on nine. To this is a, yes, this is like the Super Mario new trailer, you know, very colorful and looks good for the <laughs> colorful people. And then at the end, you're like, oh, <laughs> not like this. Yeah, <laughs> it's enough for because Chris Pratt as Super Mario. <laughs> It's a choice. <laughs> it's like when they decided to make uh, your man Captain Birdseye hot. Yeah, that was weird, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I don't think it's anything like that, but it's... <laughs> it was a weird thing that happened. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I don't know what relevance it has, but it was a weird thing that happened. No, uh, making Chris Pratt Mario. Right. Yeah. Nothing to do with the blood bowl. Why would I be commenting on the blood bowl? I'm sure okay. the blood bowl. Okay. No, in the yes, in the <laughs> Super Mario movie they are making, and this is an animated movie, so it looks very like a Super Mario game, but really well made. It really was really good, and Jack Black as Bowser is spot on. Mm hmm. And then, you know, the voice of uh, the Mario is Chris Pratt. Mm. Like, talking like Chris Pratt. Nah. They, they, like, <laughs> sorry, uh, uh, they were chunter turns. So there you go, make your own mind up. <laughs> but he nearly won. He nearly won, you know? Like, if he hadn't had anyone, everyone killed, um, he would have won, basically. Yeah, for in sure. The first half. Yes, the first half, uh, Andy was in real trouble. Mm. Saved by the dice. Mm. I don't know what his play is now. Now he does this one, one D's the wolf. And yeah, one D's the, the wolf back so that he can get the pow, so that he can go in and one D the ball yeah, he's with got, the, he's the got tackle nothing. mighty. He's got nothing good now, has he? Mm-hmm. <laughs> if he hadn't played OT like someone that's never played, it wasn't that bad PC, was it? It was like a standard, you know, YouTube cage. Like he did the YouTube cage, didn't he? But it, yeah. it meant that he could get collapsed in from both sides. He should have paid heed to Gadenik's words of wisdom. Like Gadenik had trouble scoring two turns, and well, then his solution the was, you know, that you roll more dice on t on the first turn, so you, you know, to make it stronger for the second turn, uh, more dice than you'd want to roll on the first turn, and obviously that's what Loomy had to do. He had to, you know, make some GFIs and stuff to make it over here, uh -huh. to make it uh, easier to score, and instead he just w did the safest kind of play, which was to cage up here. It was a mistake. Him. It did, yeah. I think that uh, now that he followed with the line over there, it's a mistake, because he had the... He had him follow, he had one dice on the ball with a tackle. Yeah, he still only yeah, got one, hasn't he? Yeah. But now, um, yeah. what he could have done is he could have not followed, and uh, no, nah, there's nothing things anyway. He, can make it too. Oh, he gets the power. There we yeah, go. He gets the power. Down, down goes the ball. Just quietly. Boy, oh, Harvey. there goes the ball. There are yeah. elves around. Mighty, there, mighty blow as well. Yep. Yeah. Not many elves, but there are elves around. Ooh. It's a strange not follow. Ooh. <laughs> That's not great either. Is he gonna so. dodge back around and base up the wrestler, maybe, and then just go for the five up? I mean, you know, I, I I'm giving it. It's really difficult to call anyway because I have no idea what Lumi's gonna do. Yeah. He's gonna base everything. Yeah, he's just gonna base everything. Yeah, it was a but terrible scan. <laughs> Apart from getting caught, that was as bad as it could be, wasn't it? Yeah. Yes, he's a uh, well. He's already base, his elves are already basing players, so that part is done. <laughs> Does he? <laughs> Time to roll some red dice. Um, just a just a one D into a one D, Ali Red, mm. and uh, it could go to kicks. One reroll versus none. So for sure, you know. Uh, but Lumi's just hoping his guys don't get killed. <laughs> There's no real, no real. I mean, you, see, you said now. you can five plays uh, pick it up, but you have seen uh, more confusing things. Mm. Well, it fails a two plus dodge off tackle, so 
Three. He's put oh, in the re-roll as well. In the re-roll. This is a wow. Well, I think that was a choice. He's well, he still has dodge the... at least. Pass and dodge then. Yeah, he's going for the pass catch. He's going to have five plus pick up, dodge out on a two, and hook it. But I mean, that's shit. <laughs> Do you think? <laughs> oh no, he's okay, coming around. Uh, okay, okay, okay. He's basing the ball rather okay. than a player. Okay. Yeah. He's using that reroll before kicks. Yep, he used it instantly. <laughs> he used it instantly. Okay. Yeah, so just put people on the ball, on the ball the and then hope, yeah. that, hope that Andy can't pick it up and he goes yep. to kicks for 50-50. But I think yep. that was... Just having a look at it. <laughs> but I mean, Andy can scatter and get this pick up pretty easily, so this is... Shit. <laughs> I think he had to conserve his re-roll and then also hope but you know just get his guys punched which he really enjoys <laughs> and hope that Andy won in nines or that he can get the people back the next turn or something this is it yeah like it was really hard like I don't know what is <laughs> how he wins from there but... it wasn't by using his re-roll I don't think hmm I mean, the real risk of uh, scatting the ball uh, is that uh, he could end in the hands of a high elf catcher. Yeah. But the odds of that. Oh, Whoa, also, he, you know, roll pause always yeah. works. Oh, he does scatter it. Yeah. Catches it. Well, there you <laughs> go. Well, they call it. You know, top Hello. commentary here. Top commentary. <laughs> Jesus Christ yeah. Almighty. <laughs> Hello. I would like to get blitzed, please. Well, he's because he's blocked anyway. He's <laughs> getting blocked by a wrestle get first. Wrestled, yeah. yeah. Gets blowed. Double power, you know, just in case. <laughs> now he needs the catcher to catch it. Or the zombie. Oh, oh! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh that's okay, actually now. pretty interesting. Yeah, that's, yeah. Okay. It's kind of annoying, isn't it? I mean, he's got, he's got plenty of hits left. Yes, yeah, he has yeah. many hits left and he still has the blitz, so... Uh-huh. Okay. Um, so, you know, yeah. just keep rolling pause. Yeah. yeah, just, yeah. yeah. Well, that was the... That guy has tackle, at least, so... This guy's dead. Where would you like to die, sir? <laughs> yep. yep. <There laughs> Correct. <you> go. <laughs> <laughs> we are so good at this. We are so I good at this. I know, right? This. Yeah. This is a 3D, isn't it? The worry is that, um... I, I could even consider myself playing Blood Bowl after making such amazing calls. Don't I'm not going to do it. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. No, 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 no. This is big yeah. Blue Bowl for me. You know, that I pick it. That's why I already won CCL. Everybody knows Yeah, that. you did. Twice? <laughs> Twice as a player and as a coach. Yeah, yeah. you go. Yeah. Move the guard at first, right? So that if you get a push, he's not he's not uh, trapped. So you move the guard around here. So. Mm-hmm. Ooh, ooh, that wow. blocks the tackle blitz. Yeah, it does. Oh, no, it doesn't. No, no it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> what a nice lord. What a nice lord is Andy Devo tonight. Oh, it's really funny. It all started with a foul with a wolf. Yeah. <laughs> Being a death. Oh, my yeah. God. And then he can even foul the, the guy next. To Ooh, I don't like this. Mm. Oh, I hate this. <gasps> oh, I despise he... this. What, what? Is he coming around the top and punching him back then? He must be. Oh, I hate that. Yeah, I hate I that. Like that. Oh, I well, love this blitz just... through. I love yeah, this why blitz here. And then, the yeah, yeah. And, then, and, then you, and then you pick up the ball and then you foul this guy. Yeah, exactly. Your cage is made. Yeah. I, would, I wouldn't That's even great. have this guy here. I would have had this guy over there making the cage. Yes, yeah. Wow. Wow. Oh, he's going for the foul first. So, oh, yeah, okay. Okay. okay, so if he okay. gets the removal there, if he doesn't, then, then he gets, then he gets it. through, yeah. Okay. Okay, oh, okay. Yeah, fair enough. 
But I guess that at least guy, this way. At least this way. Guy, is, well, I don't know. I don't get it. That guy thought he was safe, you know, the, the line over the like, oh, I'm safe here. Yeah. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so the action is all of the same. you for, for a particular reason. Um, right. 6-6. Six, six. <laughs> click, uh, click. Uh, well, I mean, he can, still, he can still just push the ball out with the blitz off the ground with the lad with no skills. Block just uh, up, block this uphill against the. Um, no, you can just all right, go that way. You just get. Yeah. yeah, okay. And finally, achieves the fact of having all his team on the floor. Yep. Achievement unlock. <laughs> 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 this was a game, wasn't it? This was very much a game, but um, yeah, a couple of, couple of uh, really bad turns from Lumi really cost him. This could have been a one nil win for him, couldn't it, if he'd played? I, yeah, I, it's it's turns. crazy. Like I was like, cause I, he played so well in the other couple of rounds, so I don't know. He just kind of seemed to fall apart very early in this game, and just kind of hasn't really um, identified the outs throughout the rest of it, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, like, I still think he's a good coach. He's just, you know... I think he didn't actually play well, but uh, the pressure uh, was very hard. Yeah. Mm. You know? I mean, uh, how many times, you know, you, you play well the designed play, you know, so, oh, this is the best player, and then ends in a disaster. Can you endure in a game? Yeah. He's going for the foul pretty early. I know he's got a bribe, but... Um... Devil loves to foul when he's got a bribe. Uh, yeah, he does, yeah. Oof. Oh, and he's... Oh, wow! Ooh, hoo, hoo. Ooh, hoo. Six plus okay. foul rate without dodge. Yep. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Time to roll the sixes. I mean, if he, if he gets the six on this dodge... Then it's like a three with the reroll and a three, and then he's away. Like, it's actually pretty decent if he gets the six. <laughs> or he could blitz, he could dodge and one day. Yeah. Oh, he's got sidestep. Oh, he's uh, sidestep. I was trying to work out if there was another way around, but... He could blitz this like, one, he could uphill this one, right? He could uphill that guy, but he's... I mean, he's no skills, right? So you might as well just use the guy on the ground already. No, but if you yeah. if you push him, then you're here, right? And he gets you Oh, off. I see, yeah, yes. It's like, it's amazing, yes, yes. so, like, this dodge... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or well, you just uphill this guy. From, from, this, from the front is what I was looking at. You just uphill this guy. This was the yep. play, uphilling this guy. This was the play. Uphill mm -hmm. him for a push. And then that well. pushes you to there. And then you oh, he got... didn't even... He already set up the other guy. All right. He didn't see it. He, did, he didn't yep. see the play, guy. No, you just stand up and do nothing. Yep, that's an idea. That's yeah, a, this... uh, there you go. That's, that's choice. As ah, so well, he can. I was going to say he can red eyes there. Follow. No, okay. Mm. And that has dodge, which pops. Okay, here we go. Three plus, three plus. Does he go straight in? Three plus, three plus. Or does he? Yeah, he can't make it around the corner. So, well, he can with some. Oh, but he can the one. Right? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Is the spot the girl? Oh my god! What a masterpiece for Andy Davis! How Andy yeah. was able to read his opponent choices yeah, beforehand. Just, just beautiful. It was a trap. Sure, hands fail. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this game. It's the hope that gets you. In. Mm. Where would you like to sidestep to? Because I don't give a shit. Now is when you get a triple scale for on Andy Davo, he has to make things uh, more confusing. <laughs> He's filling in again so that he can use if the wolf. He turns right play to have the ball, yeah. Correct. I don't think he'll kick himself. I think it was a hard ah, game. And, and he, he, he'll, he'll mostly wolf, just got yeah. unlucky, right? And the, the, first, the first three I turns, know. if he doesn't get unlucky the first three turns, he just wins. So. Ah. Okay. So, humans being the somewhat biased animals they are, <laughs> he probably won't beat himself up, he'll just think. He probably won't kick himself, he'll probably think, all the decisions I made were the correct ones and I was just unlucky. <laughs> it tends to be how people think. <laughs> yeah. So, being Devo, he'll want to score in the wolf, right? 
No, because there's, there's only two more games. There's only two more games. So okay. Yeah, but, you know. There's only two more games. You really want to risk a handoff or anything? I mean, you might well, go for the handoff I mean, to then just win. Much, yeah. You know? Like, make the handoff. He doesn't even, he doesn't even get away from this guy anyway, so you can't. Yep, Dave or damage free. Looking likely to get Amazons in the semi finals, who will never yeah. win Chalice. Yeah. So, looking like a great if game for Amazons. Amazons win Chalice after beating Andy Day, well, Andy will have a hell to pay. You know, that people, <laughs> Dimi will never speak to him ever again. Yeah. Thank you for the raid, Beer Monkey. Welcome, Monkey and Monkey viewers. Hope you had a nice stream, lads. Yep. Cheers. Sorry, I literally got in right before you, did I? No, I, I don't see it. So, thanks. All right, cool. You don't have your own uh, stream on your second screen. Um, it do, I have I have the Streamlabs chat bot, um, which doesn't have raids in. Oh, sure, sure, sure. So I I, I I'm so used to using like I've used that for so long. I do have the uh, stream manager open in another window, but I don't always look at it. So uh, if you're not following Beer Monkey lads, please do give him a like and follow. Lovely fella, really chilled um, stream. And uh, plays a lot of rats and uh, delves. Oh, there's another cast. Another cast, there, you know, just casually. Yeah. And I guess you just put the tackler here so that this guy would have to go all the way around. I guess you could uphill you though. Hmm. Yeah, maybe there's better. Like one mm -hmm. down. Maybe one down. There or there. We could just not hit him, right? Well, he's not. He's not going to hit him. But like, yeah. if he goes there, he could uphill you to get out. So. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. you've got to. Maybe one down is better. Maybe one down sure. is better. Yeah, because it, well, it's it's more about the multiple dodges than the other thing, because it turns it into uh, four dodges. Yeah, because if, he, if he's there, he goes 1, 2, 3, yeah. 4, 5, 6, no, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. As if he's, yeah, 1 down, or 2 down, yeah, yeah or 1 across. Yeah, lovely. Yeah, lovely. 1, 2, yep. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, GFN. Like Gowl. Mm-hmm. He's in range, but GFI, so he won't, he won't be. He's not really in range. <laughs> well, he'll just uh, one die push and uh, knock him into range. <laughs> ah, yeah, true. Yep. Correct. Oh, scoring straight in, lads. <laughs> Fucking go time. That is a canoring threat if ever I've seen one. <laughs> right? And Dave are going like, oh, didn't even push me into range. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Comedy mega. Right? But he gets to foul him with DP, doesn't he? He does, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. And completely wall off. No, not yeah. completely. Yeah, completely wall off again. Yeah. Closer. Yeah, so it's either Amazons or Woodies, and I think he's very favoured against either of those teams. Mm-hmm. Uh, so yeah, almost, almost, you know, I don't know, I don't know how, like he's obviously a big favourite, but maybe he's not that big, you know, maybe 78.2% to, uh, <laughs> to make the final Wait a second, now. wait a second, Beer Monkey, first time chat in the channel? Wow. Beer Monkey, wow. Shocking. <laughs> well, he's Shocking. Been, he's been watching loads and just hasn't uh, had anything to say before this yeah it's perfectly acceptable yeah shocking <laughs> art will get that not many other people will <laughs> well that's 
That's good. As long as somebody gets it, Jim. Somebody understands you. Yeah. Shocking. <laughs> yes, but, uh, I have of, to say, uh, this, this has been really a very interesting game. I think our viewers from Malaysia, Malaysia will be delighted with it. Yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Outrageous! Bribe. Oh, and he fails the bribe! Oh my oh, man. god! Oh, my oh, Never diced. lucky! Oh, he didn't, didn't even use it. He didn't no, use didn't it. didn't even use it. Oh, so yeah, diced. Diced. Imagine not using the bribe. Is it so he can foul yeah. next turn? Yeah. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Just he's gonna blitz, he... though. He's gonna blitz next turn, maybe. No, he's got no reroll. He has to score. He has to yeah. score. Yeah. Yeah. He has to score. Yes. I'm not he's... sure that he's going to score, though. <laughs> yeah, he has to score. I mean, come on. <laughs> you might get two SPPs. Yeah. I mean, what the two SPPs he needs is on the 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 piling on, right? And the piling yeah. on. Oh, he's over there. He no, he's not. He's piling on his. Uh, he's out over here. Yeah, he needs three on him. So yeah, just score. Uh, yes, time to write the. Yeah. GG, South game, blah, blah, blah. good luck with the rest of your uh, camp. TF. He's <laughs> <laughs> such a lovely guy, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly, Satter, yeah. He's just, uh, uh, he, I think he'll have typed GG, can't say WP. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh, lovely. <laughs> no, wow. Didn't get at all the, uh, wow, the MVPs no. we thought. No, unbelievable. I was for, thought for sure the Pining On was going to get the MVP. Yeah. Uh, 23 AV breaks from how many? Two 70 more. blocks. 70, 70 blocks. blocks. Wow. Yep. Wow. Even with Frenzy, that's a crazy amount of blocks. You cannot give up 70 blocks. No, but I mean, a lot of them, a lot of them happened because he was getting fucked already. Like, yeah. if, if that initial, if those initial three turns had gone the other way, then this becomes an easy win for Lumi. Like, it's crazy. Like, but you know, and he went that high variance route, and you know, against Andy with the wizard, maybe, maybe that was the right play. And certainly, it's how Lumi tends to play. So, you know, fair yeah, enough. Two hours and a, and a half. Yeah. yeah, two and a half hours. Yeah, so standard. Yeah, um, standard Devo Chalice match. To be fair. <laughs> So yeah, the other game that went on today was uh, was not the was actually uh, your uh, potential uh, semi finalist um, PC. So uh, we do not know the results of the other side of the, this bracket, which is a game between Tycho and his Wood Elves and Martin Septim and his Amazons. Yeah. Uh, so it'll be the winner of those that takes on uh, Devo in the semi. Yeah. In which in which Devo will be a huge favourite uh, to win and get to the final is is yeah. Will it be his first ever final? Or has he lost in the final before? No, it's his first final, I believe. Ah, well, there you go. Good, yeah, good chance exciting. for him. There you yeah, go. And, you know, fair play. Yep. Congrats to Andy. Commiserations to Lumi. Thank you. Oh yeah, he lost a try in the final. That's correct. Yep, that's correct. Oh fuck, Dimming he did you. like really recently. Yeah. Yep. So there you go. It won't this be the first final. This is why final. Demi. We need Demi because Demi is the the blah blah lore. Yep. And uh, quiz, 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 jump. Sorry. Oh, thanks, PC. And uh, right, that's brilliant. Then so yeah, so PC on Monday and then uh, the others on Tuesday. Um, yep. Thank you very much, Kalon and Fami. Absolutely glorious as always. Pleasure. Always a pleasure to be here. For... What a glorious game we watch. It really was. Yeah, it was a great game. Like the yeah, lots of lots of things happening. Very exciting. And, uh, and if you are from Malaysia, <laughs> and uh, I was pleased, leave a comment if you can. <laughs> yeah. yeah, please do. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>